All right, guys, welcome back to this 2,000-point 10th edition Warhammer 40,000 battery part. Before we get into the list, I'd like to ask everybody to hit that like, subscribe, and notification button. really does help the channel grow, and I'd like to thank everybody who's done so already. Also teamed up with Lumpy Game Store, Recess Games. Click the link below. Go into their e-cart. Buy anything in the store. does not have to be 40K related. Uh, get, they'll ship it right to the house. Get 10% off on your purchase. Um, hit the promo code Monster when checkout. You have to actually have to type it in. Uh, uh, in all caps, Monster. Get 10% off on your purchase. Also, I never mentioned this. I just started doing this in the last video. They have a great rewards program. So um, the more stuff you buy, the more report points you get. Uh, and then I'm mean, gonna get a lot. Of, I get a lot of stuff with the rewards. So, I mean, it goes anywhere from the 50 to 100 dollars off. Um, and it's it is it is nice. You can use it on anything that you. Uh, even if you're doing it through the web the web page, you can still use that point stuff. So, yeah, take a look at it, uh, check it out. With all that being said, let's get into it. So, guys, I haven't played my Salamanders in 10th edition at all, so I figure you know since we're gonna do back to back bat wraps, I might as well do some other stuff. I know a lot of you guys come for the Death Guard. Uh, I'm not gonna play Death Guard today. I think uh, so. We're gonna go with, with Salamander. So we have exactly. 1,009, I think it's like 1,980, 85 points, something like that. Can't remember exactly what it is, but let's start uh, Let's start with my Warlord. So my Warlord is going to be Falcon Hassan, who is a custom model that I put together. So he's going to be my Warlord. Uh, he is going to be uh, attached or leading some uh, Assault Intercessors. Uh, I also have, we'll just start over here, I have two units of um, inceptors ignore the plasmas they don't have plasmas I uh, they plasmas were good in ninth edition um, no I'm sorry I did give them I did give them plasmas never mind they do have plasmas I apologize for that so plasmas we also have two units of uh, eradicators um, one of those guys will have a multi melta the other ones will have just melta rifles I am going to have to, because he's not done, uh, this is going to be an apothe uh, apothecary by Elogius. My other one is still on the painting table over there, if you can see him. Uh, but I'm going to use this as, I'm just going to have him be a stand-in. He's going to be teamed up with the Eradicators. Uh, we have a three-man unit of aggressors with the Flamestorm Gauntlets. We have a unit of uh, Terminators with Bolters and Fists. We have an Invector Warsuit. Um, he's going to be equipped with uh, have a, a fist, frag storm, grenade launcher, heavy bolter, a twin iron hand heavy stubber, and a twin iron hand auto cannon. So that's what he's got going on. We have some assault centurions. We have some, two units of infiltrators. We have another unit of terminators with thunder hammers and storm shields. Uh, we have just our land raider by itself. No Redeemer, no uh, Crusader. Uh, the Land Raider is going to be equipped with two Gun Hammer last cannons, uh, Hunter Killer, Melta, Multi Melta, Store Bolter, and Twin Heavy Bolter uh, for that. We do have Agatone, uh, Adrax Agatone, who is going to be uh, also with some uh, um, assault, assault Intercessors. So this is a little sneak preview of this is going to be my, my custom. My custom uh, Space Marines Army, which this is the Dust Raiders. If you are a Death Guard player, you know that these are. This is the origin, the Terran origin of of uh, Death Guard. I'm a big fan of Nathaniel Garrow, so these are going to be basically sons of Garrow. And then we have the uh, Agent of Imperium. We have the Vindicare Assassin. That is going to be. Uh, I do have a. I do have an enhancement on the. Biologist uh, on the apothecary biologist, and that's going to be the uh, forged in battle. So that's what his is going to be, uh, which is I can turn a hit or a save into a six. Uh, I'm also going to do the frags uh, flame. What did I say it was? Uh, say fl frame f flame storm gauntlet or no flame storm? I might have just went blank, guys. The uh, the Frag storm assault, whatever. I'll, I'll when we go back into it, which is going to be basically all my weapons are um, the detachment. All my weapons are going to be assault and a plus one on the on the strength. 
whatever that one is, I'll say it when we come back. I don't remember what it is, but uh, well, I'll say it when we, before we deploy. So that is my army. So let's go take a look at Voltan. All right, guys, here's this nice painted up Voltan army. Um, so my, my guest today, my buddy Slade, he's just coming over. Mm -hmm. This is the first time. We actually just met uh, a little bit ago. A yeah, a month ago. Yeah. Month of turn. Yeah. yeah, so, hey, man, the good dude. I was like, hey, why don't come over, play some games with me? So, all right, Slade, what would you bring today? All right, so I got 1995 of Votan. I'll start over here, I guess. I got six uh, Thunderkin. They're all going to have the uh, anti-vehicle Graviton guns. They have the character attached, the uh, Forge Master. He's going to have the Enhancement Grim Demeanor, which allows him to ignore modifiers. Uh, and then we have right over here, we got a five-mana Berserks, all with the axes and then with the grenade launcher uh, attached. They're going to be in one of these uh, Sagittars. Okay. Uh, we also got two uh, ten man of Warriors. They're going to have all the just free upgrades on them, and they're going to be split up into these two Sagittars, five and five. All right. uh, we also got a big ten man of the Terminators with the Fist and the uh, Plasma Guns. They're going to have the attached character, the Call, who's going to be my Warlord. He's got a Praising Glare, which allows him to pick an objective marker, and they get plus one Judgment Token uh, for anyone who's on that objective marker. Then we got a three-man of the bikes, just for the uppy downy uh, support piece in the back. Then we got another five-man of Terminators with the Swords and the uh, Vulcanites. They have an attached character. This is my custom model for the uh, champion, and he has Hammer, and he also has the Wayfarer's Grace Enhancement, which allows him to come back on a two-up when he dies. Uh, then we have... Uh, a land, which is going to be these five terminators of the character are going to go into this land fortress. Well, let me let me get a side view of this one, man. This is <laughs> yeah, the the big boy. He's gonna he's gonna monster, be running up in the front. Truck, dude. Yeah, with the, with like, with the grave digger <laughs> flames. Uh, and then the I also have a second land fortress, which is not, nobody's going to be inside this one. And they're both going to have um, bolt cannons with the uh, what's it called the beam the the beam gun. I think it's called a beam gun. Yeah, I was going to say beam gun. <laughs> yeah, beam and gun. that's the full list, yeah. <laughs> all right. So, guys, uh, this is modeling to disadvantage for Slade, so <laughs> can be seen all over. And basically can go all, all over every terrain without even God, worrying about it. But, uh, all right, we will be back with the mission and the deployment. How many points? 1995. All right, we'll be back with the mission and deployment. All right, guys, we're back after the mission and the deployment. So here's what we got going on. We're going to play um, Crucible of Battle which is this diagonal deployment zone, obviously. Uh, I'm going to be on this side of the table. Slay's going to be on that side of the table. Um, so we got that all set up. We're also going to play as our primary mission. It's going to be taken hold. So everything we, every uh, objective marker that we have is going to be worth five points with a max of 15 points per round. And then uh, target priorities, which allows us to draw an extra uh, mission card. We're both playing tactical, so it's going to allow us to draw an extra one and to discard the other one. So I, I think you have to discard it. Yeah, you draw three, and you have to choose from the three. Yeah. Uh, anyway, all right, so that's what we got going on. Uh, we'll back this up so you can kind of see the table. Uh, playing on some a similar table that we just got done playing on, and that's our versus Custodies just because it was up, and so they came over the day after, so I didn't, want, I didn't feel like taking it all the way down. Um, so basically, same kind of rules. You guys seen this, this, this terrain before. We are going to play first floor line of sight blocking on everything in the back of the deployment zones, um, except the middle of the of the board. It's going to just be cover. But if you're in, if you're outside of the footprint of the terrain, then you obviously this is going to be ruined. So it's going to be obscuring. We do play the rubber band rule. So if you wrap a, wrap a rubber band around it, that would be the footprint. So if you're inside there, that you're you're in it. Uh, if you are inside it, like these guys are, you're going to get cover. So I'll get cover from that. Um, and then uh, the the crates are going to be un, um, unbreachable, unscalable, and uh, unstable ground. So you can't go through it. You can't climb up and you can't land on it. I don't think it's going to be a problem in our game because we don't have anything that flies. Uh, I believe that is uh, these here are going to be first floor line of sight blocking. However, they are not going to go up infinity. They're only going to go up this high. So if he can, for example, if his monster truck then can see me, which actually is built a little bit for advantage and disadvantage, he'd be able to shoot over top and, and clip me if he needed to. Uh, so that's what we got going on. The billboards, however, uh, Prometheus finally got, finally my 3D printer is back up and running. So if you are watching this, um, I will, in fact, get this out to you this week for 100% sure. 
Um, so that is actually Prometheus's. Uh, so but what I do with these is every bat rep, I will drag, I will uh, pick a new subscriber who comments below. So say hi to Prometheus, say hi to us, uh, correct. If you do correct us as far as rules go, we ask that we just do it politely. But I will take, I will pick a subscriber out of the hat and I will feature them on my next bat rep. Um, and then we will, uh, and then we will uh, uh, just give you a little shout out because I do appreciate this. Um, for members, if you're a member, if you decide to become a member and support the channel that way, uh, after three months, I will customize a billboard for you. Uh, we will play it on the channel and then I will send you that billboard. So that's if you become a member. So I, I appreciate those who are members. I appreciate those who watch, share, and view the channel and comment below. All of that is great. Um, Prometheus is a big a big supporter of the community, so I do appreciate him as well. So he's getting a shout-out because, number one, I didn't have enough time to go get the other ones done. But So that one is done now. So Prometheus, you'll be getting it probably by Friday, hopefully. But uh, all right, so that is... That is what we got going on. Uh, we got deployment. So I have, I have my, uh, my thunder hammers and storm shields, uh, my hammers and shields, terminators inside the land raider. I have both units of inceptors up in the air. I have my other unit of terminators up in the air, and that. And then I have, as far as the deployment goes, I kind of deployed a little bit cagey because. He does have the ability to shoot me off the table in turn one, which would be a boring battle report. But if it happens, it happens, and I would definitely put it up. Because if you're a Voltan player, that would be cool for you. If you're a Saliban or a Space Marine player, that would not be cool for you. So, <laughs> so to watch it. So uh, kind of here, um, put a blob here. These guys here are getting this objective. All these guys, I got my my biologists and uh, eradicators there with, with um, the... Assault Intercessors, man, I can just see it's going to be a tough day for me today. And then uh, Eradicators, Inv Invictor. And then for to try to stop his scout move, I put these uh, these guy Infiltrators here and these guys here just to kind of stop the stock scout move. So what would you do on your side, sir? All right, so we got the Sagittars all bind up over here. Now Sagittars do scout six, so I kind of put this guy here, you know, so he can hide back here if I go second. Um, or if I, yeah, so if I go second, so he doesn't get shot. So the same thing with this guy. This guy's gonna he can, you know go forward. He's got the warriors inside of him to threaten this objective. And then if you, you know if he goes uh, if I go second, he can just kind of hide it back a little bit here. Um, we also got the two land fortresses. Um, this one I just knew I wasn't gonna be able to hide it, so I just put it on the line right <laughs> in the middle to be like it's got guys inside of him, so it gets right. close to me. You know, counter charging threat. We got the bikes over here in the corner. You know, they also have a scout nine, so they can potentially come up here. For this objective where they can hide behind this building uh, so they don't get shot and then also keep them on the board edges because that's how they are able to go back and reserves they can be within six inches of the board edge right uh, and that's pretty much it so Everything when you scout are you allowed to come within 12 9 12 inches no no so you can't be within nine of an enemy unit so gotcha. these infiltrators will stop me from scouting within nine gotcha do you want first or second turn sir i think typically you think first is, is better for a lot of scouting but i think also in this game We'll yeah, see. We'll I think see. I can, I, I'm, I'm not sure if I want first or second because if you come closer, that benefits me. Yeah. If, if you don't, then I guess we'll see. We got uh, both got a four. All right. Let me get that six out of there. Yeah. Three, six. All right. You'll be going first, Slade. All right. Let's have a good game, buddy. Good game, all man. right. We'll be back after Slade's movement phase. All right, guys. We're back after Slade's movement phase. Cards, sir. Okay, so the cards I got were Bring It Down. Well, I, I got Bring It Down, Investigate Signals, and Behind Enemy Lines for right. the mission roll, and I discarded Behind Enemy Lines, because obviously it's turn one. That's yep. not happening. Uh, investigate Signals, I got this five-man of Warriors. I moved to the back. They're going to do Investigate Signals. And then I got my bike squad in the back corner. They're going to do Investigate Signals as well, so I'll get it for um, two corners. Okay. Uh, and before we get into your turn... Would you do scout move first? Yeah, so scout moves. We did the Sagittars here. I actually scout moved this Sagittar back so that I could uh, deploy these guys. I thought I thought I was going to deploy them on the home objective, but luckily it was like I got investigate signals, and I was like, okay. And then I just went and deployed them back here. Right. Um, these guys just kind of moved up a bit, um, and then those guys moved forward, and then they ended because I was going to have them shoot the infiltrators, but they ended up just going backwards because I got investigate signals. So. 
And the skeletons weren't and that important. Came up a little bit. Yeah, that guy came up just to deposit the berserk so that they could be so they could be right here. Okay, and judgment tokens, uh, we have it on the land raider. We have it on right so the, the land raider, we have it on these centurions here in the front, these infiltrators, and then the unit of um, terminators and deep strike. Right. Okay. And, all right, and then for movement. Movement. I yep. moved these guys up here in the middle so they can get a charge in on the infiltrators. And even if they don't get a charge off, then they kind of move block some things. Like if you did Terminators out, maybe protect the Sagittar. Move the Sagittar up. These Sagittars, I, got, I did get bring it down, so I'm going to try and see if I can put some shots into that Land Raider. I doubt I'm going to kill it, but we'll see. You know, very swingy with the guns. <laughs> I move these guys over here so they can get a kill on these infiltrators. So I get my detachment rule off, and so I get my 3 CP turn 2. And I was going to move this guy a little bit more forward, but... You know, you have a lot of dangerous Centurions and melee guys over there. <laughs> so I'm going to keep them a little bit far back so I can counter charge you turn two uh, when you move forward. Yep. And then that's pretty much it for me. All right. Sounds good. And we'll go. So, guys, it's uh, Fire Storm Assault Force is what, I'm, is what I am. I forgot to say that earlier. Okay. Where are you starting, sir? Shoot. Okay. So I think we'll start with, I think we'll just get the this Hecaton out the way, the small right. one. Just because it can't really see anything else, so it's going to shoot those infiltrators right there. So it'll just put everything into them. All right. So we'll start. We'll shoot the uh, conversion beamer first. So are it's you on. within twelve? Are you outside of twelve? Are you closer than twelve? I'm closer. Okay. So we're not going to get the conversions on the fours, but we will get the D three sustained on that six. Okay. Which is going to be two extra shots. That's two hits. And this is going to be strength 10 versus toughness 4, so on 2s. And dropping those. So that's going to be 2 at AP 2. 2 at AP 2. I will take it on the guys in cover. Behind there, at least. Uh, land forces ignore cover. Okay, so no, I will not. AP 2, so it's going to be 5 up. Uh, save 1. Okay, damage 4 flat. All right, let me uh, roll my funeral pins real quick. Uh, 6 up because of Helix Gauntlet. Not a, one guy dies. Okay. We'll take it on this guy back here. And then we got the... But I'm just going to move this over a little bit, so I'm blocking Number one, gotcha. Thank you. Okay, so we're going to do the auto cannon, which is just going to be yeah, sustained six shots. Hitting on. Hitting on threes, because the judgment token. Yep. And this is going to be strength seven, so winning on twos, because the judgment token. Yep. I mean, the one, so it's going to be three at AP one. So... Ignoring cover. No cover. Damage so, two each. Two each, okay. So that's gonna be four so that's gonna be uh first guy, sixes, dead, second guy, dead. So three dead so far. Okay, and then we're gonna do the bolt cannons, which will have sustained one twin linked. Hitting on threes. No no sustained. And then this is gonna be winding on twos twin linked. Because it's strength six. Yep. Uh, so just re-rolling the one for twin links. Got another one, so that's three at AP1. Three AP1. Ignoring cover. Four ups. Damage to each. All right, first guy uh, stays alive. Second guy, or same, kills his first. One more. Got one more left, man. One guy left. There's one guy left. Uh, okay. Well, I can't see him with the second guy, or with the second Land Fortress. You can, you can see him, dude. That's what I'm saying. I can. Oh, I was, you can't. No, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because this front part. Yeah. I'm not going to measure from the tires. No, I get, yeah, I get it. <laughs> that's ridiculous. <laughs> uh, so we're going to do. I measured it out. I can't range the Land Fortress. So we're just going to put. We'll put his um, bolt cannons into that last guy. And then we'll put everything else into the infiltrator squad in the middle. Yeah, just because right. they're the only other thing we can see. Um, so we'll do the conversion beamers. Oh, you can't reach the land raider. Yeah, I can't reach it. Oh, I see. Because I've deployed too far back. Uh, we got a sustained. <laughs> so those, I uh, will do the big gun and the infiltrators are not judging first. So right. because no judging token, I didn't hit on this. Right. But I did get a sustained D3. So I get two hits. And then again, strength 10. Okay. So this will be on wounding on twos. Ignoring cover, correct? Ignoring cover, yes. So three. Three at AP2. AP2, so it's going to be fives. Uh, two, damage. four damage each. Four damage each. Yeah. All right, first one wipes the dude. Second one wipes the dude. Two guys die on that one. Okay, we'll do the auto cannons into those guys again. So hitting on fours. 
grabbing all of this. It is strength seven, so wounding on threes. Yep. Uh, yeah, AP. so one at AP one. Ignore cover. Good. Okay, and then we're going to do the auto cannons, or the bolt cannons into that single infiltrator with the judgment token. All right. So it's going to be sustained six, okay. hitting on threes. So I did get a sustain, so I'll get one back. Yep. And this is going to be winning on twos, 28. So we're rolling that one. That's going to be four at AP one. Four AP one, so four ups. Damage to each. All right, let's see if I kill, let's see if you get them. Come on, I need some sixes. We need some crazy sixes. All right, there's one. That, both of these got to be sixes. And they're not. So they die. So you All got right. 17 command points. <laughs> 17, yeah. The next thing. 17 <laughs> command points. All right. So then we're going to do... Uh, two of these guys died, too. Uh, we'll pull the guy. I'll pull the guy that makes this... A little bit harder to make the charge. Okay. Okay. Yeah, they should have the range on that. Okay, so this Sedge Star in the back, he has the Sedge Star missile launcher. Um, he's going to put his. I can see those guys with this guy. Yep. Okay, okay so he's going to put his L7 missile launcher into those infiltrators because it only has 24 inch range. And then everything else is bolt cannons and his missile launcher into the land fortress. Or right, the land, land Raider. Land Raider, yeah. So we'll do the one shot for the L7 first. Hitting on fours. Got one. We'll do the focus shot. This is going to be strength nine versus toughness four. Yep. And twos. One at AP. I believe it's one. For Did the... ignore cover? Uh, no, this guy does not ignore cover. Well, doesn't matter because I got a two. It's going to be D6 damage. So three. Six is one more dice. All right. Then we're going to do so the two Sagittar missile launcher shots hitting on threes because of the against the land forge or against the land raider. <laughs> I'm all <laughs> excited. I used to call it land forge land raiders. Now I'm getting it backwards. Thank you. Um, so it's going to be hitting on threes because of the jungle token. Okay. So both hits. Shrink 10. Versus toughness twelve. Yep. So that's good. it. Would be on fives, but because the judge can go into fours. So one at AP three. AP three, cover no cover. N a good cover. All right. So it's going to be AP three down to AP two. Uh, I need a four up. Nope. Damage. Three flat. Three flat. So he's going to be down to. We have sixteen wounds, so it's going to be down to thirteen. Okay. Uh, with twenty side dice in there. Yeah. And then we'll do the twin bolt cannons. Yeah, because they do have 36 in range. There's going to be three shots. Sustained one, twin links. Hitting on fours. I uh, didn't hit. Or no, hitting on threes because the judge took because it yep. is against that guy. Yep. So this is going to be strength six. So that would be sixes, but plus one. So on fives, twin links. Okay, so one at AP one. Good. He's good. He's got a two up save. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a land. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we're going to do. This um, Sagittar into the same guy. Okay. That, he, so this shot, did this one shoot yet? This one is not shot yet. All right. So that all came from this guy right here. Yeah, that all came from this into guy in the this, back. And then now that one. Is now this one's going to shoot everything into the lane raider. All right. Because I would like to charge something. So we're not. I'm not going to. I don't really want to kill those infiltrators. Gotcha. Like to charge them. Uh, we're going to do. So we'll start off with the beam cannon. Ooh. Hitting on threes. So this is going to be strength. Make sure. Yep, strength 12 versus strength 12. So it would be on fours, but plus one to wound, so going to threes. Didn't do it. So the beat, uh, bolt cannons. Got the hits. And again, this is fives twin links because it's. Because uh, it's not nothing. enough to a. Yeah, well, it's fives twin links. Yeah. The judgment token gives it on fives. Yep. Um, okay, that's it for that guy. And then this guy is going to do the same thing. The one, this one yep. in the middle that deposits the berserks. So we got this guy here going into the land raider. Yep. With his beam cannons. Ooh, I did get a sustain. So sustain D3 on the beam cannon. So I got one extra shot. So this is going, we're going to be on fours going to threes because of the judgment token because it's strength 12. So that's going to be one at AP3. AP3 down AP2. Get cover. You let me know if it's no cover. No, yeah, yeah. It's AP, only for the big boys. So AP2, uh, so four. Good. Saved it. 
And then the bolt cannons. Ooh, I did get a sustained, actually. That's nice. Uh, okay, and this is again five we're rolling. Nope, nothing. Let's do that. And then the last thing we got to shoot is the grenade launcher from those guys. Uh, it is indirect, and it does give the basilisk effect where it's minus two to movement, minus two okay. charges, minus two to advances. So we're going to hit it. We're going to shoot it at... I'll do that jump pack intercessor squad with the uh, big character in them. That one? Yeah, we're going to shoot it. Assault. Assault. Assault intercessors. I have no jump packs. <laughs> oh, well, yeah. Well, the assault intercessors with the character. Yeah, you're we'll good. shoot at those guys because that'll take down right. to four inches of movement, which is pretty good. Yep. So it's going to be D6. Is that a five-man squad? Five-man squad. Okay, so D6 blast. That's your six-man squad, so. So just going to be two shots hitting on fours because you don't have a judgment token. So nothing. So don't even get to roll for the thing because I didn't hit anything. Um, okay, then that's it for shooting. All right, charges. Charges. It's going to be the one charge that berserks into those infiltrators. All right. I think you probably need a five or something. Let's see what I roll. Ooh. Five, yeah, that would let's be. Let's see where you... You might, you might be in them. And... Yeah, let's just do that. You're in, for sure. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's good. That was a four-inch charge. All right. Okay. So uh, we'll move. be back after he moves all this. Okay. All right, go ahead. Okay, so I charged in. Got everybody in. Uh, base to base, I would say everybody but this bad guy should be in combat. Okay. We're going to do the, because they have the axes, so they get to pick their profile. We're going to do the strike profile, which makes them each three attacks. All right. You, you don't have a judgment token, so they're going to be hitting on threes. All right. Dropping. And this is going to be strength six, so on so threes. Threes again. Okay, so it's going to be four at AP two. Four AP two. So it's going to be four five ups. Um, okay, damage. Damage to each. All right. First guy. Takes one. He dies. Takes one. Uh, it's going to die unless I rolled sixes. It takes care of that unit. Okay. Infiltrators off the board. Infiltrators off the board. Okay. Would you like to pile back to that objective or stay where you are? Um, yeah, I think I will do that just so I can move block again. So I think that is, that is exactly what I'm going to do. So we're going to put him. Okay. Just go like we'll do the rest of that off camera. What would you score? So, scoring wise, I got. Just four for bring it down, or for investigate signals. Investigate I mean, signals. yeah, okay. I didn't. I, know I didn't score bring it down. I'm going to discard bring it down right. for CP. So we got one there, one there for four, and we will be back after my movement phase. All right, guys, I'm back after my movement phase. So I had gotten areas and now as my cards, and uh, behind enemy lines, not great. I also got capture enemy outpost, which was another not great one. Um, so with all that being said, I did not do a whole lot of movement. I'm going to try to get um, aerial denial. So I moved my land raider up, took the terminators out. We're going to try to uh, clear this area out with that. Moved the advanced, my uh, eradicators out, and I also moved my uh, uh, um, Victor uh, warsuit. In Victor warsuit out. Thank you. Moved it out. I advanced him as well because of the storm. Because of the uh, storm fire, all my weapons are assault, so I can advance and still shoot. Um, and then that's really uh, everything else kind of just stayed back because I need him to be a little bit closer to me because I got a lot of close range stuff. So let's just start with, uh, let's just start with my Vindicare just because I want to be able to shoot him at something. So I'm going to shoot him into these guys here. And so he has, a. Uh, we got, uh, the, uh, Exodus rifle, which is actually is 48 inches. But I don't know if I can see that. Can we give me a measurement from there to up over there? Is that 48 inches? Yeah, it's 44. Um, you can shoot these guys. Uh, I guess we'll just, just for fun, we'll do it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, just for fun, we'll go all the way over to that unit there with them instead of going here because I'm hoping that everything else... Nah, dude, that's silly. Let's just go into them. I don't want to leave one guy remaining and then lose. Yeah, yeah. Lose. All right, so uh, hitting on twos. Hits. And then 
We have uh, strength seven, toughness, toughness five. five. So it's going to be uh, it's going to be threes, and it's going to ignore cover. And sixes are devastating. So at with one at minus three. D3 yeah, plus 3 damage. They have a 6 up armor save, so right. roll for the damage, and I can roll for my kill. Well, you don't have a... Right, it's a 6 up armor save. Oh. Um, what do we... Damage, right? Yeah, I did damage. So it's going to be 5, five damage. Uh, I'm sorry, 4 damage. Okay. 5 up kill no pain. Uh, that one guy's dead. Alright, so we're going to go to the... Uh, we're going to go to Land Raider. We're going to put everything into... Well, I don't say everything. Let's uh, put my last cannons... What's the strength on the... Uh, what's the toughness on that, Sagittarius? Sagittarius are 10. Strength 10. 10. All right, so put the last cannon into that, and then uh, we'll put the uh, Melta into that as well. And then I'll put all the small arms fire into this. How many wounds does it have? Nine. Uh, yeah, and I'll put all the small arms fire into these guys here. Okay. So first we have... Um, I might... I have three CP. Yeah, you're good. I might pop armor contempt. Or, you all know, right. our void armor. Which void is armor? Because okay. yeah. your, your AP is going to be, what, four? AP is three on, this, on the last cannon first. So take it to a two, so I can take it to a five up. Mm, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll spend armor contempt on this guy. Okay. Make him a little and... Bit and uh, You'll be able to take it on this guy in cover, but I can't fully see his base can't from this part of the gun. So you can at least get you do get at least get one cover unit. Uh, so here we go. We're hitting on uh, hitting on threes in the box. All right, misses. And then wounding on twos, wounds, and minus uh, just one at. Oh wait, this is onto the this is onto this thing here. Yeah, the Sagittar? Yeah. Yeah. So that's going to be... How much AP? It's a uh, minus 3 AP. Okay, so going to 2 because Armor Contempt. This is going to be a 5 up save. Nope. How much damage? Uh, D6 plus 1. 4, Ooh. 7. Ooh. Okay, so that's going to be down to 2. On the 2? Yeah, it'll be down to 2. All right, and then we have the uh, Melta, which is just going to be one sh uh, 2 shots. Hitting on 3s. One hit, and then it's going to be strength nine, toughness ten. Ten, so fives. Nope. Cool. Uh, no, I don't reroll it. All right, then we have uh, hunter killer, which is going to go into that as well. Hits and does not wound because I believe a hunter killer is only a uh, whole oh, hunter killer is twelve. What did I just roll? Gold is All right. Does not wound. <laughs> and then the storm bolters going into the small guys. Uh, they have rapid fire two, so it's going to be four shots hitting on threes. This misses. Uh, strength four, toughness five. Yeah. Or four on those fives. So just one. Add uh, no AP. One at no AP. Um, six up then. All right, I mean, yeah, it doesn't matter. It's a one. Uh, how much damage? Just one damage each. Five up film of pain, doesn't save it. So one guy will go down to one wound. And then is that all the shooting from your land uh, raider? I have one more, which is a twin heavy bolter. Okay. The hunter killer I don't have anymore. So twin heavy bolter is three. Uh, it's, up, it's two of them. Strength five, toughness five. So four. Two at uh, AP one. Nope. So he's dead. All right. All right, I know heavy bolters were sustained. I just, I didn't remember if I rolled a six, so we're good. Okay. Uh, that's the end of the shooting for that guy. Yeah. I do have two CP left, and this guy is alive. And he, you have a judgment on that guy, so I'm going to pop the two CP okay. for uh, shoot back. So I'm going to yeah. shoot back with that Sagittar against that Land Sounds Raider. Good. So the two shots from the uh, beam cannon. Ooh, both hit. So that's going to be strength 12 versus 12. So it's going to go from 4s to 3s because of the judgment token. So 2 at AP3. AP3, so we're going to be 5s. Uh, one. 1. Okay, so it's going to be D6 damage. 
Four, five. Five, all right. It's down to uh, eight, eight. And then the bolt cannons got a sustained. So that's four shots. Um, this is going to go from fives to, or from sixes to fives because of the judging token. Re rolling because of twin linked. Uh, nothing. So just one at AP one against the Lambert. Good. Okay. That's good. All right. Mm -hmm. Um, so now we're going to do, well, yeah, we'll go with, uh, we'll go with the Eradicators. We're going to go into the Sagittarius. Uh, one of them has a multi melter which I hit on fours, but total obliteration because it is a vehicle, it's going to be, uh, re-rolling hit rolls, wound rolls, and damage rolls. So the first one is the Melta, which is multi melter which is two shots hitting on fours. Uh, both miss. Reroll that. Uh, just one. At, then we have its uh, strength nine, toughness ten. ten yeah. So fives, uh, wounds, and it's going to be the uh, minus four. Do I get cover? You do get cover. Okay. In that case, it's going to be a six up. Don't. How much damage? D six or five. Okay. He's down to four. Uh, guys, I forgot to pick my ultimate moment target, so we're going to have it be. Uh, we're gonna have it be. I'm not gonna pick something I'm shooting at now, so we'll pick this as my ult the moment. Um, I will make this. We'll make these guys my ult the moment target because I'm gonna charge them. So yeah, you need to kill them too. So I mean, it would have made yeah. sense if we picked them. Yeah. yeah, it would either have been that that this guy or it would have been one of those two units. So um, I got to be fair about it. Not when I'm shooting at now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then the other two uh, just single melters, which are hitting on threes. Uh, let's re-roll that. So both hit, and then straight nine. So fives again. Uh, so both miss, and one at minus four again. Okay, and then cover. So we're going to six up save. Don't save it. How much damage? Right, so hopefully we get a four. You get a four. And we we get got a six. six. Yeah. Right. Does he explode? He does not. He does not explode. But did the guys inside of him get damaged? Is the question. All right. So we'll see. No, uh, no, they're all good. All right, we'll put, we'll uh, get all this out and we'll be back. All right, guys, after uh, charging, piled in everything there, um, decided I was going to charge my Land Raider. I actually missed the charge, um, spent the CP, re-rolled it, got in with the nine. Now I'm going to spend one for shanked Tank Shock. So I have a Strength 8 weapon. So uh, it's going to be eight dice. And your Land Raider is, or I'm sorry, your Sag Star is 10. Correct. Yep. So I didn't. I do not get. Uh, I do not get the extra two dice for every five I roll. It's uh, more than one. Up to six. Only one. Only one. Only one. Down to one. All right. Not exciting. So now we'll just go into. Uh, <laughs> uh, do you have enough to interrupt? No, I spent all my CP. All right. Yeah. So we're just going to go right into that and see if I can. Armor tracks is six dice. Hitting on um, fours. So we have uh, four of them. Uh, I need fives because it's strength eight, toughness ten. Uh, two. And no AP. Does it still have void armor? Well, no, 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 it's no per phase. So per phase, yeah. So this would be three ups. Failed one, saved one. So he will die. Does it blow up? That's a great question. Oh, it, it does, does blow, blow up. up. It is deadly demise one. All right, so. Six inches. Would that get my little dudes over here? I really hope it doesn't. It doesn't. Okay. All right, so that's going to be down to two for me on that. It's going to be down to seven. Nice. On this. That's good. that's good. And then this guy. One of these guys should be at, he'll be at one. Oh, wait. Let me do the, actually, so I'm not paying for him. Yeah. No, All, right. Take it. Okay. All right, so now we're going to go with the hammers. And, uh... Uh, you got to roll a battle shock test, I guess, after my charge for that. For the berserks? Yeah, for. Uh, got it. Pass it. Okay. That was on the charge phase, so I, I'm just reading the card off to you. <laughs> All right, so uh, we have five hammers. We're going to have uh, four attacks each. So that's going to be, I'm sorry, three attacks each. That's going to be 15. Fifteen hammer attacks, hitting on fours. 
hitting a force. Uh, they are my ultimate moment target. And all right, so that all works. They're all hits, I should say. And then strength eight, toughness five, five. hitting on threes, uh, sixes are devastating. These all miss. I don't know. So there's three, four devastating wounds. Okay. And then looks like six minus twos. Okay. So how much damage is all of it? Uh, One so each. it's six. Yeah. Uh, yep, the devastating wounds would be yeah, so, 20. so 20. Jesus. All right. So uh, they don't get a save, huh? No, they don't get a save. Yeah, I'll just do the fill my okay. pants. Do I even roll this? I don't even need to roll this. Let's see. Let's just do the four first. We'll do the four devastatings. Okay. So we'll do for the first one. Five up. Um, he's dead. Second one. The front guy. He's dead. And then the third one. He's down to two. The last one. He is down to one. And then for the first of the regular attacks, he's oh he's actually he's alive. alive. For the second <laughs> of the regular attacks, he is dead. Okay. So they're all dead. Now, do they fight on death? Oh, that's a good question. So they fight on death in four ups. We'll do the first axe guy. He doesn't. Second axe guy. He doesn't. The big axe guy. He does. So I do get one fight on death. So that'll just be. Uh, what's the type of some terminators? Is five or five? Five. Five. So in that case, we're gonna do. Okay, so we're going to do the strike profile, which is going to be four attacks. Hitting on threes, because you know Judgment Token. And it's going to be strength six, so it'll be on threes. So it's going to be three wounds at AP2 against the Terminators. Three wounds at AP2. Yep. So it's going to be four ups, regardless, four up armor save. Got a two up armor save and four up invulnerable, so uh, takes one. Damage? Two each. All right, kills one. Let me pull these guys. Cool. Dude, cool. you did kill a guy on the way out, man, which was good. I know. That's nice. I'm going to just pile in the rest of these guys up here and get them on the objective. And then I'm just going to pile in that way, get him on the objective. And then uh, I think you give some judgment tokens out because I killed Yeah, them. so these these guys killed the unit, so they'll get a judgment token. And also the these guys killed that Sagittar, so they'll get a judgment token. Judge All right, so at the end of my turn... Uh, did not get behind enemy lines, which I'm actually going to keep. Uh, I did get five for um, the Air of Denial because nothing yeah, else is yeah, there. Yeah, nothing's there. And, you're in it. and then we'll be back after Slade's Movement Phase. Okay. All right, guys, we're back after Slade's Movement Phase. Slade, what card did you draw, sir? So I got Storm Hostile Objective and Extend Battle Lines, and I discarded uh, Defend Stronghold just because okay. of the Inceptor threat. Right. Um, then I moved, so I moved... These guys back a little bit so they can go back into reserves at the end of the turn so they're within six inches of the board edges. This guy's just moving up here to hold this objective. Uh, I got the Terminators in the character outside of this land fortress. They moved up and then he moved up right behind him just for fire support. I got this Sagittar just moved up from here to up here. These guys hid behind this building to hold the objective to give it sticky next turn. And then I brought in my unit of Thunderkin with the character right here uh, as strategic reserves. And then I have these two little guys just sitting here holding this objective. Okay. Do they take a battle shot? Uh, no. Yeah, they, they should be taking a battle shot. Because <laughs> it matters. Uh, five, they would fail. Yeah, so they are battle shocked. All right. So then at that point, it wouldn't matter for them actually holding the objective. But I, I don't need it anyways. Okay. So I already have multiple objectives, but they would be battle shocked. All righty. Um, shooting. Okay, so shooting. We're going to start with that land fortress because he can only see really these two things because those mm -hmm. guys are all hidden. Okay. He's going to put everything into the Land Raider. Alrighty. Um, let me just double check that he can range with his main gun. Yep, he can range it. Okay. So you're talking about this guy first? Yes, the small okay. Land Raider. The double deuce, I like to this call guy it. Right here. So he'll get conversions on threes. So that doesn't hit, but this will be D3 sustained. Yep. He'll get one extra, so two hits. Strength 10 versus... So be on fives are going to fours because of the judgment token. So one at AP two. And ignores ignoring cover. cover. AP two, so four up. Nope. Damage uh, four flat. Four flat. He's down to three. 
Okay, then we're going to do his bolt guns, or his auto cannon first. So hitting on threes because the judgment token. Only two hit. Strength seven, so that's would be a uh, fives going to fours because the judgment token. That's one at AP one. AP one, so it's going to be three up. All right, saved it, and then we're going to do the bolt cannon. This is going to be sustained. Six, so we get two sustain or three sustained. Dropping this one, but, oop, bringing it back, getting three sustained, and this is strength six, so it's from six is going to five, so five strengths. Uh, only one five. Not so a great roll. <laughs> yeah. <no. laughs> Do you know cover? Or twin link. Uh, twin link. So there we go. There we go. That's that's more. Four. Like. So four at in AP one ignoring cover. Ignoring cover. All right. So three ups. One more. I only damage one more. two. I only one more. There's four. Oh, okay, one more. Yeah. So two damage. Two damage that each. That will get him. Um, Does he explode? What else do you have to shoot at him? I still got. Well, no, that's that was all from that guy. That was his last gun. That was from this one, right? Yeah. So the question is, do I want to make you shoot at him with other guns? Are you thinking about rerolling him? Yeah. Because re yeah, it would. Yeah, it would make you at least put other guns into him instead of putting them in the Terminators. I'll do that. So uh, it was AP minus one. Yep. So I'll spend this one CP and three up. Good. Yep, saved him. So he's down to one. He's down to one wound. Okay. I'm honestly kind of okay with that. Doesn't bother me too much. Basically, it's trying to. Yeah, I see. You're you know, it's got it's shooting. What economy. is the? Are these guys four wounds or three wounds? There are three wounds. There are three wounds. Okay. Yeah. I, I didn't know if the shields give a wound or not. Um, not these guys, man. I wish. Okay. They did. Then I think what we'll do here is we'll put this land fortress. He's going to put his big gun and his auto cannon in, or no, his big gun and his bolt cannons into the lane raider. Okay. And then his auto cannon, which is this one right here, it's going to go into the Terminators. All right. So we'll do the Terminators first. They do have a judgment token. So mm -hmm. it's going to be one, two. That's six shots, hitting on threes. Pretty good. And Sustained. Then, no, not sustained okay. on this one. Uh, what's the toughness on those guys? Four? Toughness is uh, five, four. I think. Uh, I'm not sure. Terminators, I'm pretty sure it's five. I'm not sure. My death guard terminators are six. I mean, it's strength seven anyway, so, so otherwise yeah, three. it's going to be yeah, three, yeah. So that's going to be all of them. One, two, three, four, five at AP1. Five AP1, so three ups. Uh, one damage. damage, two. Okay, so one's down to one. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to select, because I hit him, I'm going to select him for the real target for these Terminators. All right. But we're going to shoot the rest of it into the Land Raider real quick. So right. two shots. You're too close for conversions, but I would do, so you'll get one hit, but I do get a sustain because they rolled a six. One extra shot. Tell them five. Tell them five on them? Yeah. yeah, okay. Uh, so this is going to be three hits, and then five's going to fours because it's up to ten. So one at AP two. What is that going to into? In the Land Raider. Okay. One at AP2 ignoring. From what? Oh, this, this guy. This guy, yeah. yeah. So one at AP2 ignoring cover. One at AP2 ignoring cover, so four ups. Nope. Does he blow up? It's a big blow up. Nope. Oh, I saw it. <laughs> I saw it. Okay. Judgment token back there. Thank you. Did get the Land Raider kill yeah. turn two, which is pretty good. Yeah. Getting a turn two is not bad at all. Uh, we're going to do. Hmm. I don't really want to kill too many Terminators because I do want to get a charge. So we'll shoot the Terminators into the Terminators. Or my Terminators into your Terminators. All right. So that's going to be... We'll do the... I guess we'll do... You have one wound on that guy left. We'll yeah. do the grenade launchers first. So it's going to be 5d6 blast. But you only have four guys, so it's just going to be 5d6. So that's 1 and 2, 5, 8... Uh, 14 shots. So, 6, 9, 12, 15. I know, 14, so dropping one. Okay, so hitting on 2s because of the judgment token. Pretty good. It's all of them except for one. Yeah. <laughs> and then this is going to be. Do you get rerolls on that, though? 
No. Well, I thought you gave him re-roll. It's re-rolls the wound. Oh, the wound. Okay. The wound. So this is going to be wounding on. You don't have a judge. You don't have a second judge token, so I don't get plus on a wound. So it's only strength four. So it'll be on fives, but re-rolling the wound. Okay. So fives, re-rolling. Oh shit! I need to re-roll. Oh, I'll re-roll like a couple of them. <laughs> No, there was all of them, man. Yeah. But I don't know how many it was. I forgot. <laughs> then you got. Wait, you got. Let's see. It was fourteen. 14. I dropped one. So yeah, it was a. Uh, so fourteen. You got. How, you got that many left, right? Yeah, five. So I rolled two. And then you just roll. We rolled these. Two, it's, three, four, five, six, seven. So. So seven more. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Five more. Yeah. There we go. Okay. So that's going to be. One, two, that many. Did everyone wins, right? Yeah, AP zero. AP zero, so two ups. The armor saves, only one. Uh, take take a uh, that will kill this one guy. Okay, then it's going to be... It's going to be the Vulcanites. So this is going to be three shots each, so 15 shots. And then this is devastating. Okay. So that's what the reroll is really why you want the reroll wins. One, two, three, four, five. Hitting on twos again. The judging team. So dropping these ones. Okay, and then this is going to be rolling wounds. Again on fives, because it's strength four. Yep. So six is devastating. Pretty good. It is pretty it's good. It's going to kill one so far. Unless they're Only. one wounds each. It's one damage each, yeah. Oh, okay. And then re-rolling. Ooh. It kills two. Good. And then no other. So only one roll that you're making on AP zero. He's good Saved there. Saved it, and then just take seven mortal wounds. Seven more. Yeah, that was a lot. Yeah, so that's uh, one's down to one. Okay, so that does make my charge one's significantly... One's down to two, actually. That makes my charge significantly harder, but honestly, it's re-rolling charges, so I'm <laughs> pretty confident in it. Yep. Uh, so we got left, we have this Sagittar. He can only see... This guy? So go. he's just going to shoot that guy. Yep. So he's going to do his Sagittal uh, Missile Launcher. Uh, you don't have a gender token, so whiffs. Uh, L7 Missile Launcher. Hits. This is going to be Strength 9 versus what's the toughness on that guy? It's a good question you asked me. You posed to me there, Slade. <laughs> the Invictor Warsuit. Uh, toughness 8. Okay, so that means a 3. Got it. AP one. Actually, it's AP two. AP two. But not so, ignoring cover, and you would get cover. So all right. So effectively, uh, AP one. Four up. Uh, I'm sorry. Three armor save down up to four because the cover takes damage. D six for six. All right. He's down to uh, six left. Uh, the bolt cannons into him. Uh, this is going to be six. So if he is eight. Yeah, no, nothing. Okay, that's it for that guy. All right, so uh, put that six next to him, please. So then all we got left is these two guys and then this squad. So I think this squad is going to shoot first. We do want him dead. So I think we're going to put... Because these guys are eradicators of three wounds. Three wounds each. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to put all of the Thunderkin into him and then the character into the eradicators. All right. So... We'll do the Thunderkin first. That's going to be six. And then they do have the Ignores modifiers. So um, anything, I don't know if you have any modifiers. No, I do not. Yeah. So that's going to be six shots. This is going into the Vindicator, or the... Uh, the uh, Victor Wars. The Victor. So that's going to be three, 13, 17. So that's going to be six, 12... 14, 15, 16, 17. Okay. Hitting on fours or threes? Ah. Uh, it's going to be threes because the character gives them plus one hit. Okay, cool. Good roll. That's dropping ones and twos. Okay, and then this is going to be anti vehicle two up. And the Victor War suit is a vehicle, so just on twos. He's a vehicle, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I was going to say, if he's not... I was not, double checking. 
Because some walkers what's, what's like AP? aren't. Uh, AP2. AP2? Yep. So it's going to be uh, five ups. Uh, damage. damage two each. So you two. just need to fail three of them. Yep. Fail three. Oh, man. Just fail three. Well, he's one right here. Yeah. Does that blow up? Okay. All right. All so right, if you dead. don't mind, Slate, if you just uh, hand me that dice and put him on that table behind you, it'd be great. No problem. Okay. So the character, you double check his amount of shots. I'm pretty sure it's three. He's going to put his shots in the eradicators. So three shots hitting on twos because he's getting a plus one from the judgment token. And he hits on threes naturally, so that's one. It's going to be strength five versus toughness five for yep. yeah, Gravis. That's going to be on fours. Get one at AP one. They're toughness six, actually. Oh, well, I got a six. Okay. So what, what is it? AP what? One. Good. They're good? Okay. Uh, then the only thing left is going to be these guys, which I guess will shoot at... I'll shoot the Vindicare. Oh, is he loan up? Yeah, he's loan up. Oh, yes, I can't even shoot him. Okay, I guess we'll shoot at the Gravis guys, because why not? One bolt gun, or an Autoc Patton bolt gun, which hits on threes because of the Judgment Token. That's only shrink four, so nothing. And then we'll do the... Are you within rapid fire for these guys? Well, he has, a sp he has the um, auto... What's it called? He's got a special gun. You're within rapid fire. So it's going to get six... Six hits. Or six shots, I mean. Let's find the name of it. Yeah, the high auto rifle. Okay, yeah. So three, so hitting on threes for the judgment token. Let's right, re roll it. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to do that. Dropping that one. And this is going to be strength six. So on threes, four. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, six, fourth. it would be fours. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. That's just a five. So two at AP1. Two AP1. So they're going to be uh, four ups. Nope. Damage. Damage one. I want it down to one. Charges. So the only charge we're really going to do is the Terminators and do that term the lone Terminator by himself, which we'll probably just be able to kill in. Uh... Eh. Seven? Seven. Like seven okay. So seven re rolling. As the character, yep. he's never rolling charges. That's going to be a four. Nope, five. Fail the charge. All right. All right, well, in that case, that is the end of the turn. All right, and what'd you score? Um, I'm going to score extend battle lines, but I will not score storm muscle objective because I didn't take an objective that you held. Because yeah, you weren't on this one, and right. I didn't take that one because I couldn't, couldn't, couldn't reach it. All right, we'll be back after my movement phase. All right, guys, we're back after my movement phase. So uh, we had, I got behind enemy lines and defense stronghold. The other one I got was, I don't remember what it was. So all the ones that we care about are behind strong, um, uh, defense stronghold cleanse. and behind, an, oh, cleanse. That was it. Cleanse, yeah. And didn't need cleanse at all. So uh, here's what we did. So we moved in, moved these eradicators up to threaten this point and to threaten those guys. I dropped in my inceptors back there, kept the Vindicare in. Uh, right where he was, I advanced these guys here to get some shots off at that. I didn't get a big enough advance to get the um, the Sagittar, excuse me, the Sagittar, um, but we did uh, get at least a multi malta at range of that unit. Uh, advanced these guys up to start getting up the board a little bit. I auto passed this uh, this Terminator so I can hold that objective, at least get that ten points. I advanced these guys here. They're going to put their um, mount the shots into that. I also advanced Vulcan, uh, Vulcan's unit up a little bit as well. Um, so actually, I don't know if I advanced. Yeah, I think I did. I don't think I did actually. It doesn't matter. But uh, I moved these guys up. Uh, Vulcan's going to pick this unit here because he's within 24 inches of it. So I can reroll wounds with Malta and Torrent weapons onto this uh, onto this um, land land fortress. I kept these guys in the back in case he decides to come back here anywhere, but I think you're all on the board. Yeah, one more unit off the board. No, uh, nothing. everything's on the board. Everything's on the board, so now I can get those guys in the fight if I need to. I also dropped these guys, I believe it's called or uh, Orbital uh, Descend, which I can come within three inches of an enemy unit. I just can't charge. So I dropped here. He did Overwatch with this land fortress and kill one of them. Um, 
preventing me from taking this objective from them actually. So which didn't force me to kind of bring these guys down here because I do want to stop him from scoring. Also is going to give me five points on behind enemy lines instead of just three. And I think my Terminator is then kind of forced a little bit uh, for him to rapid ingress down with his Terminators, right? Yeah. So they can maybe stop this from happening and just me sitting on his objective. Uh, but either way, we're trying to play it a little bit more of the mission with this army. Uh, so now we're going to go into shooting. Um, I'm going to start with my Centurions. Is that, your, is that also your open moment target? Oh, also open moment target. That's a good question. That's a very good... Uh, Thank you for reminding me. Um, I'm going to make these guys here my alpha moment target. Okay. All right, because I just I really want that unit to be gone. Is that what I want to do? Or should I just see if I can concentrate while my melt is on this? Because if you put that as your alpha moment, you'll be getting reroll hits and wounds. Yeah. Because of Vulcan. Because of Vulcan. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's see if I can do it. Right there. Let's do it. All right, so first ultimate moment is this. We're going to go three attacks, and they are hitting on threes. We just make sure that's that's the truth. Yeah, hitting on threes. Rerolling these two misses. All right, so that's two. And then... No, that was a three. Oh, three, that's right. Uh, three of them, so it is now strength, um, nine, toughness, more. So I need five to rerolling. Because of Vulcan, re-rolling. So just one at AP four. Six up. Tell that. All right, D six for two. Is it plus? Uh, no, it's just um, I'm gonna actually re-roll that for four. At least get four on it. Do you have a Melta? Melta is a uh, Melta two, but I got to be within six. Oh, within six. Okay. Uh, and, that, and that's just twin link, so. Let me roll one more. Yeah. Hold oh, no, on, I re-rolled it already. Re-rolled the wound rolls because of Vulcan. Because of Vulcan, yeah. So it'd be four. So four total? Four total, okay. yeah. Okay, so he goes down to... He's going to go down to 12. Okay. And then we have... Uh, that's it for that. And then we're going to have the Inceptors. So Inceptor... That was all their shooting? That was all their shooting. It was just three multi shots? Yeah, just... That's it. They're not, they're assault, they're not, they're assault centurions. They're not, uh. Oh, they're the melee ones. Yeah, they're the melee ones. Oh, okay. Gotcha. They just have three melters, that's it. But, uh, but having all the moment on that, trying to get that wounding at five. Yeah, is just, yeah, you know, I got you. Um, all right, so now we're going to go with, uh, I'm just going to start with these inceptors here. And we're going to go into those guys there. So we have, I'm not going to supercharge it. Wouldn't make any sense. So I'm hitting on threes. Which is going to be, uh, let's see, this is four shots each, hitting on threes. Uh, so we have two of them, or three of them, I'm sorry, wounding on threes. And so we have three of them at minus two, two damage. Okay, so it's going to be six of saves. Saved one, so two will die. All right. Which we'll just take the back ones. And I'm just going to stay here with my Terminators. Uh, so they all have bolters, which are going to be four shots. See if I can't pick some of those dudes up. Hitting on threes. These miss, these miss, these miss. And then it's going to be strength, four, toughness. Five. Five. So fives. Oh my goodness. Do you mind helping me? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. All right. So I'm just going to take out the hits. Not a bad roll. Mm -hmm. So we have uh, eight of them. Add no AP. Okay, so eight four ups. That's their save. These guys, right? Yep. Uh, they're dead. All right, so we're gonna go with uh, these uh, assault intercessors. Are gonna go into the these guys here with their bolters, and that's five shots, hitting on threes. 
This one misses. Uh, right? Yeah, so toughness so they're four. They're toughness six, but they're minus one to wound if your toughness is, or your strength is higher than my Okay, toughness. it's not. So, toughness, I'm winning on fives. For two and minus one. Okay, so two, three ups. Good. All, right, all that for nothing. <laughs> all right, so now we're going to go with, uh, we'll go with those guys over there. And we'll go, actually, we'll shoot first with this one. Melta into these guys over there. Your, I don't know what they are. The big guys, Thunderkid. Thunder the Thunderkid. And then are you gonna? You're, these two guys are in range. You want to put the rest of the shots in these two guys? Yeah. Okay. Exactly. So we'll go with th this fir first guy. Will go back there. The second guys will go into that. They do not get total obliteration. <laughs> Porky pig right there. Uh, all right. Threes. Hits and then this is into the thunder can first. Yeah, so that is strength or toughness six. All right, so threes again, just one minus four. Uh, do I cover? Means you can't see this guy, right? You can take yeah, take it on the guy that, that can't okay, see. Okay, then yeah, then in that case I get a uh, th six up save. Nope, I'm gonna get it. How much damage? Four. Okay, so we kill like yeah, we kill like that at the end. All right, so then the other two are going into the other the guys behind that crate. One and one. Okay, they don't get that safe. So this guy just dies. Alrighty. So then we have, uh, I'll have these guys here go into those Thunderkin as well. Okay. So we're going to have, because that one guy, yeah, I'm not worried about that one guy. So here's the commander with the multi melta hitting on force. Just the one. And then wounding on. Not twos. And then the other guy. The other two. Hitting on threes. Both hit. And then uh, threes. And both wound. Minus four into the Thunderkin. Two of them. So two into the Thunderkin. Minus four. Uh, I don't get to save on that. Because it's just four up. Or it's just a three up armor save. But okay. what we'll do is we'll take it on these little drone guys here. Okay. They didn't do it on the first one because I needed the cover. Yep. And pull the drones. We'll go with the Inceptors into the Thunderkin as well. That's going to be hitting on threes. Not supercharged. So, four of them. Wounding on threes because they're strength seven, toughness five. Toughness six. Toughness six. So, threes, twin linked. So, four of them at minus two, two damage. Four minus two. Okay. Just gonna be five ups. Yeah, pretty good. Saves. Oh wow, that's pretty good. So we're gonna take two damage, so we'll kill the assistant because he has two wounds. Alright guys, so uh we're gonna go with the Vindicare into the Thunderkin character. Uh so we're gonna have one shot hitting on twos. Hits. And actually that's critical hit, so it's gonna be a D3 attacks. Uh, add three to the damage characteristic. Well, that's silly. I'm really <laughs> going to kill this dude if I hit him. Uh, strength is going to be strength seven. So threes. Oh, no CP to reroll that. Did you roll it? A two. Yeah, we'll try this charge here. I don't know if I can get it off. I don't know if it's a smart move, but we're doing it. And it's only an eight, so that's not enough. So at the end of my turn, we will score... Um, defense stronghold I'll get next turn. Mm -hmm. Define unless you get to my my deployment zone. And uh, behind enemy lines, we got four or five. I was holding one, two for ten. Mm -hmm. You are holding z uh, one, one for five to start the round off. And we will be back after Slay's movement phase. All right, guys, we're back after Slade's movement phase. All right, what card did you draw, sir? So I got Engage in All Fronts and Area Denial. Area Denial is pretty easy. It's just one Terminator in the middle. Yep. Engage in All Fronts. I moved this whole guy up so I can get it for at least three corners for this mm -hmm. one, this one, and that one. Um, okay. All right, so this is going to be interesting now to see how this finishes out, man. All right, so we got... I think we'll start... With that land fortress, we're going to okay. do that one into the Centurion's right in front of them. All right. Because it's a clear shot. Let me see what, uh, you have AP on there. Um, 
That's going to be AP2 and AP1. And you do ignore cover. cover. They're going to two up save. Uh, I think I spend. I think I spend one for armor contempt. Okay. On them because I just want to keep it as a two up save. Yeah, gotcha. Okay, the beamer only got one hit. Okay, so that's going to be strength as uh, strength ten versus toughness. Toughness seven. Okay, so that's going to be threes going to twos because the judgment target. The one at AP two. AP two down the AP one, so three up. Good. Saved it. We're gonna do the uh, so the auto cannon. Hitting on threes. Strength seven versus toughness seven. Mm -hmm. So on four is going to threes because it's judgment token. So two at AP one. Two AP one down the back down to uh, AP zero. Two ups. Good. Okay. And then the bolt cannon. So it's going to be sustained one when linked. No sustained hitting on threes. And this is going to be six. This is going to be five. It's going to fours because of uh, judgment token yep. and then turn length. So looking for fours. So just three at AP1. Three, uh, keep going back down to zero. So twos takes one. Two damage. Damage two. takes two. All right, they have uh, four wounds each. So one's down to two. Mm, okay. So I think what we'll do here is we'll split fire in this guy. He's going to put his bolt cannons. Anyway, his bolt cannons into the Centurions, his main gun in the Centurions, and then his auto cannon into this Terminator by himself. All right. So we'll do the Terminator first. I hope this, I hope this Terminator has, sees a laugh. He has only one judgment token, so he's hitting on threes. Okay. But strength seven, so it's just going to be on threes. Four? No, just three. Three AP is zero. AP one. AP one. So threes. Yep. Damage it two. Does. Cool. And then we're gonna do both cannons. Yeah, the centurions. Yeah, so hitting on three, sustained. So getting that one back so it's sustained. And then this is strength six, so it's gonna be fives going to fours so the judgment party. Dropping, dropping, drop. Oh, twin length. So we're rolling these. We'll drop in this one. That's going to be five, five. AP one. AP one back down to AP zero. Two ups. Two ups. Good. 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 And then the main gun. Uh, hits with one. Strength ten. Uh, that's going to be. Yep. This is going to be on two. So, so one three AP up. Two. Three up. No. Oh, takes damage it. four flat. Kills the one. Kills the one. Mm, two land fortresses and only one dead. That's kind of shocking. But I don't think that's... I think that. Armor Contempt was actually pretty big right there. Yeah, it did. It did save you a lot, actually. So I think we'll do the Terminator squad right there, the tiny one. Mm -hmm. We're going to put everything... We'll do, we'll do it in the Centurions as well. Okay. Because all this stuff's going to be AP0 anyways. All right. So you're... So I just want to get some dev wounds. So off. we got these guys going into the Centurions. Yeah, Centurions as well. So that's going to be... 15 shots for the Vulcanites. Hitting on twos because of the judgment token. Dropping all these. No rerolls this time because we didn't get out of the truck. And this is going to be four to sevens. So. They'll be on fives going to fours. Mm -hmm. But devastating on sixes. It's pretty good. So once once down to one wound just on devastate, or not, are they two wounds? It's just one damage each yeah. yeah. That's gonna be three devastatings and then four saves at AP zero. Alright, four, two ups. Um yeah, two ups. Alright, good. So one's gonna be down to one. Okay. Then we'll do the grenade launchers. So D6 shots. That's gonna be nine. 13, 16, 21. One, two, twos. All right, so dropping ones and twos. Okay. And then all of this is strength four against them again. So again, it'll be fives going to fours. Pretty good. Got one three in there. 
No, you just put a four in there. Oh. I thought it moved it in the camp four. Okay. Uh, twos. Uh, oh, three. Three of them. So I'm going to kill the one. And uh, one's going to be down to two. Okay. And then that's going to be it for their shooting. Mm, he's still alive, though. But that's fine, I think. Just one guy is not going to really do much. Maybe I'm wrong, but who knows. <laughs> uh, we'll do uh, everything from the set jar into the Terminators. Okay. We have Judd tokens. So we'll do the set from a launcher being on threes. Strength 10 versus toughness 5. Yep. So on twos. Nope, got a one. Okay, both cannons. Oh, well, L7 is a launcher first. Six, strength nine. So on three is going to two is because they're in token. The one at AP2. Good. Okay, both cannons. Just For those watching, they have a two up save, so. All right, so this is going to be six versus five. So on twos because they're in token twin links. That's three at AP1. AP1. Um, threes. Take one. Two damage. One is on the one. So we're going to put all the plasma guns into the Terminator squad and all the grenade launchers. Okay. Into the Inceptors, just right. because of a range problem. So we'll do the... And then we'll, we're going to pop a CP for sustain two. All righty. So we're going to go down from five. To, or was I on four? No. I was on, so we're going to three. Three, yeah. Yeah, so... All right, so this time, where are you going first? So we'll do the grenade launch or the plasma guns into the terminators first. Okay, supercharging. Uh, Votan cannot supercharge. No. It's just flat damage. Two, would be three. Uh, so that's nine, ten. Ten shots. So this is going to be sustained two lethal hits. Six. All right. Because of the character. So six is will be lethals and sustained. So I'm going to get two, and they're going to be hitting on twos because they're terminators. They naturally hit on twos because the judge is token. Okay. That one's lethal, you said? Yeah, that, that one six is lethal. And it's going to be strength nine versus five, so on twos. Because of the judgment token. Because of the judgment Just token. so everybody knows. I'm... Yeah, yeah. Okay. And then that's going to be. AP. AP is going to be three. AP three. So it's going to be on my four ups. Uh, damage? Two damage each. All right, so it's going to kill the one. It's going to kill the second, uh, another one. That's going to kill two. And it's going to kill three. So three dead. That's this guy here with the one wound. We'll kill uh, this guy and this guy. So it's going to be six, nine. Okay. Now we're going to do... Uh, we're going to do the... Group. Grenade launchers into the Inceptors. Now, the Inceptors don't have a Judgment Token, so they're not only going to be sustained one instead of sustained two. Okay. So that is how everything works. And no Blast. It's only two models. Three, seven, twelve, seventeen. We'll get the dice three. ready. Oh, oh, oh. oh, the left. All right, so 40 shots. Hitting on twos. Uh, sustained one, lethal six. So sixes will be lethals and sustained. Pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, there's sixes. We do have sixes over here. Lethals are good because of the toughness. It's mm -hmm. about to be very high. So we'll get... Uh, Dropping ones. Getting nine back. Fives. All right, so this is going to be a strength four. Yeah, so fives. I'm just going to take out the fives and sixes. Are you taking out fives and sixes? Yeah, over here. Yeah. Alright, man. So this is going to be AP0. Zero. AP0, zero, so I'm going to need uh, threes. Yeah. If you want to pile them in. And we'll see how well we roll. <laughs> there we go. A lot of three ups. That does not look like a lot of three ups. One, two, three, they die. Okay. Got them. Yep. Everybody just into that eradicator squad of the character. All right. Actually. So that's going to be, we'll do three shots from the 
character. Neon twos. They get plus one to hit. Uh, okay. Yeah, from the character. Yeah, the character gets plus one to hit the squad. And this is going to be strength five versus seven to six. Yep. Okay. One five. So one at AP two. AP two? No, AP one, actually. AP one. Four up. Good. Four up, saved it. Okay. So it's going to be D6 shots on the rest of the guys. It's going to be 10. 8, 9, 12, 22. Okay. Hitting on threes because the character gives them plus one to hit. 22. Oh, that's real. Uh, okay, so twos and ones dropping. I mean, that made a big difference. <laughs> you might still pick them up though here. And then again on fives. There will be one. One. That was a much worse roll than I did. That was a way worse roll. It's a one, yeah. But I'm fine with that, because that was my bad. And saved it. Alright, so that's going to be the end of my shooting phase. Didn't do as much damage as I thought I was going to do. Um, but, I mean, I still... A lot of stuff is dead. I mean, still got a lot of stuff dead. I mean, this is the... Yeah, killed that squad almost. Killed the Inceptors. Almost killed the Terminator squad. Yeah, th this is big, because this is the only unit I think I have left that can take off. I guess... The lane fortress. I guess the Maltas, but... Yeah, but I think, yeah, I, I, but I think you're right. I think that was a big thing, killing those guys almost down to that, one. That was big because charging them, they have big, they have a melee unit. So charges, the charges we have several charges. So we're gonna do this squad into these eradicators, which is almost a guaranteed charge. So we're just gonna roll it real quick. Yep. What is it? Eight. All right, just put the dice next to it, and we'll we'll move it all afterwards. Okay, so that's gonna be an eight. We're gonna do this squad into the. Jump pack guys, or not okay. the jump pack guys, the assault <laughs> intercessors. Assault. All right. Keep, keep thinking they have jump packs for some reason. Uh, and the reroll charges. So I got a six. six. Does a six get there? That's a good question. It looks like it might. I don't know. Charges. Yeah. Okay. Six, six gets there. Six gets there. Yeah, we're not going to reroll it. We're just going to say Anything six. else? Um, charge wise, I could battle. I could tank shark something, but I think I'm not going to do it. Yeah, I think that's it. All right, guys, we're back after the pile-in. Uh, I can't interrupt, so we just did the, as you guys always know, we do the pile-in um, before because I can't interrupt. So piled-in and everything over here, piled-in and everything over here, you have some charge and yeah, the charge rules. The champion does charge mortal, so we're going to roll a d6. We got a 2, so it's just going to be d3 mortal wounds. For 3? Three. 3 mortal wounds. I mean, that's that, ain't, that ain't bad. Take this guy out. And this guy will be at one. And then we'll do the fights. He's got the hammer. Just going to stay here with it? Yeah, we're just going to do okay. this one. Resolve this real quick. Okay, so hitting on... You don't have a judgment token on there, so nope. just hitting on threes. Okay, so it's three hits, strength 12. Uh, so I think that makes it twos. Twos, yep. Let's Damage. Or three AP, AP two. Uh, five ups. Uh, nope. Damage, so D6 plus one. So it's range damage too, minimum. Yeah, damage, so that's going to kill uh, one, two, three. Okay. And then we got all the little guys. Actually, pretty good. That's a pretty good roll. So they each have the blade gauntlets, which is three attacks each. Hitting on threes. Mm. Because of any different tokens? So ones and twos. And then this is gonna be strength six, so on threes. Yeah, okay, that's gonna be so that's six at AP two, but only damage one. Six at AP two? Yeah. So fives. Probably should have rolled those separately, but it's okay. Uh two of these guys, two goes on my one guy. Um Agatone has uh He's got a two up save, so since I rolled two twos, the rest of these will be saved. Yeah, that's right. All right, I'm not on Agaton, but Vulcan. So this guy's dead. And then he's still alive? Yeah, let's just consolidate with that guy. You coming into him? Yeah, just consolidate into him. And then you can do the slapbacks. All right. Uh, we will do this one over here. So the character. The Ford Iron Master. 
I'm gonna have three attacks, hitting on threes because of the judgment. All hit. Strength nine. Six. So on threes. So that's gonna be two at AP one. Uh, so it's gonna be four ups. Damage three flat. All right, kills one. Okay, then we're gonna do. All the other guys are in combat. Twelve. These are hitting on threes. And this is only going to be strength four, so on fives. So that's just going to be two. AP. AP zero. So three ups. Good. Good enough. All right. All right, and that should be it for my turn. All right, so I'll just stay there with two of them. And they're going to have uh, three attacks each. Hitting on threes. And it's going to be strength four, toughness. Six. So fives. So two. And AP zero. AP zero. We have save. Failed one. So I'll just go the last round. Okay. And then Vulcan over here. Uh, do I have precision on this weapon? I do not. I was hoping I did, but I do not. All right. So uh, we have six attacks. Hitting on twos. So this one misses. And then strength six, toughness. Six. So fours. So just uh, one at minus two. Good. All right. All righty. So at the end of your turn, what did you score? I scored engaging all fronts for three quarters. Uh, So I get two VP, uh, or no, I'd go to three because it's tactical. Hold on a second. So three VP, and then I'll get full for arrow denial. So five for arrow denial. Five for arrow denial, and then three for engage, yep. and then we will. I'm holding. Uh, I'm only holding one now because you've taken that one and that one away from me, and we're not. I'm not on that one, so we'll be back after my movie phase. All right, guys, we are back after my movement phase. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to cards of Drew. No prisoners and engage on all fronts. Um, so I did get engaged. So far, I got engaged, but I had engaged last time twice, and I, and I blew it by charging it. Um, I put back, uh, what did I put back? I can't remember. Yeah. Uh, secure No Man's Land. Land. Yeah, because I don't, I'm not 100% sure I can secure No Man's Land, so... I decided not to do it, so fell back here. I am going to use my one C. I'm going to use a strat. Let them shoot. Uh, we'll, we'll we'll see what happens first with these guys before I do that. Um, moved everything here so I can get some shots off on this land on this land fortress. Kept that, those guys over there. They're going to take some shots here. Kept the vindicator up, obviously over there. Moved these assault intercessors to this um, objective. Put these guys up so I can get within twelve here. Dropped Hassan back. And move this guy there and then moved up over there. So um, just to get my engage and possibly charge this Sagittarius. So that's where we excuse me, that's where we are. Let's start here with total obliteration into this thing here. So first we are going and uh, this is my ultimate moment target here. So I guess you know what? Let's see what this uh, one lone uh, centurion can do. See if he can. I do have one auto cannon. I'm sorry, one. Uh, it's one Malta. This is my my ultimate moment for one Malta. Hitting on threes, hits. Uh, wounding on. So it's a strength nine. Firestorm because I'm within twelve makes it go up one strength. Ten. So now it's ten. So toughness I'm, twelve. Toughness twelve. So I'm still wounding on threes or four or fives. I'm sorry. And misses. Come on, man. Okay. Uh, we're going to go with those guys shooting here. Uh, I'm going to put all the safeties of the AP4. But before I, before I say misses, that, that is a twin link. So I roll a three on that. Yeah. Uh, that hits. Okay. So minus four. This is melt a two. Okay. So that's four makes the six up. 
Nope. D6 plus two. For two. That's so four. four. That goes down to eight. Yeah. Too bad I don't have a CP for that. <laughs> if that CP wasn't so important. I couldn't kill it anyway, but... All right, so now... Did you want to do anything before I go into this obliteration? Uh, so I was going to probably Armic Attempt the okay. Wing Fortress. I'm making it a... Making some three ups or five ups and All right. six ups. So here we go. Uh, the multi Meltus hitting on fours, re-rolling. Both re-rolling. Uh, just one. Strength is now... I'm not within 12 there. So You're hitting on fives. Fours? I'm hitting on fours, yeah. Oh, okay. On the multi Meltus. Oh, on the okay. on the melter rifles, I'm hitting on threes. Okay, gotcha. Uh, so I need fives. Nope. These are the two melter rifles. Um, I think you get to reroll them. Four. Oh yeah, for the uh, for total obliteration. Yeah. 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 So still misses it. Um, so threes. This is my hit on my second ones, and then the fives rerolling this one for obliteration. So just one minus four. Going to three, so that takes two up to a five up. Good. Save. All right. So that was not exciting. So I guess we got the second squad. Yeah, which uh, is not going to be that great either. I'm gonna I'm gonna spend one so I can shoot again. So force. We rolling that. <laughs> All right. Meltas did nothing. All right. So now we're gonna do the Vindicare, who is going. How many wounds does this guy have? He has five. Five wounds. I'm gonna put the Vindicare into this guy there. And you're gonna pop the yeah. no save. Uh, what's the yeah? What's the guy? What? How many does that guy have? He has four. Four. Let's uh. Or let me double check. I'm pretty sure it's four. Let me shoot the, my. Let me shoot my revolver pistol into that one guy. Forgot about that. From my Balogis, my pop the carry. Yeah. So the Iron Master has four wounds. The champion has five. All right, so first here's the pop the carry going in that one one guy. Yeah. He has a, a Zolver pistol, so it's one shot, hitting on threes, hits. And then it's going to be uh, strength five, toughness five. Fours. Man. So not good so far. Um, I think I actually pulled these guys out of range. They need to be within 18. And... You're on. Just that one guy is. So I got one. It's not going to do anything, but let's try it. Threes. Fives. Good. Minus mm -hmm. one. Five up. Failed it. He's dead. All right. How about that? How about that? <laughs> <laughs> All right. So now we're going to do uh, these guys here into this squad. So it's going to be uh, three D6 plus ones. So that's going to be it's pretty good. So five, six. Dude, if I could have asked, I couldn't have asked for a better roll on that particular. So it's D6 plus one. So that's going to be six. All right. Now we're going to be, uh, these are current. So this is going to be strength four. Um, toughness five. So fives, re-rolling. Seven, six. Five. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, and so I'm going to take all these out. These are hits. And it's twin link, so. so we're just going to add uh, that many more in it. These all miss. So that many, add no minus. At least I don't think there's a minus. You're within 12, so there's minus one. Okay, so this many three ups. How much damage each? Just one damage. Okay, so one guy will be at one wound. All right, so that wasn't exciting. Man, not enough is dying on this turn. Slade, well, not rules, enough is dying. The has been rough for you, my guy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to do the, um, we're going to do those guys there into my inceptors into those. We're not going to supercharge. We have six attacks hitting on threes. I, am I within 12 now? Oh, these are plasmas. So it, doesn't, it doesn't matter. You're and, in 12. Yeah, but these are plasmas, so oh. threes. So three of them at minus two, two damage. Three at minus two, so that's going to be three five ups. 
Failed two of them. How much damage? You said two damage. Two damage. Yeah. So it's gonna kill one guy. All right. The uh, Vindicare into your character over there hits anything but a two. <laughs> Look at this guy. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, so charges. Well, here. Both got. Uh, might as well do it because these guys here are hitting on threes. And then wounding on fives. Actually, that's six, right? That's uh, toughness 10. Toughness 10. So just one. No AP. Okay. All right. Charges. Right there. <laughs> Um, these guys here charging in the dome. All right, at yeah. least they're in. That's golden. And then this guy here. All right, he's in too. All right, so we'll uh, let me move all this and be back. All right, guys, we're going to start here first. So we got uh, Power Fist, which are going to be three attacks each. That's going to be nine attacks. Um, hitting on threes. Be nice if they were sustained or anything, but they're not. Uh, strength eight, toughness uh, less than eight, so threes again. Uh, they are is twin. This for the the uh, that's right here. It is her. Yeah, so they're minus one to wound if your strength is higher than my toughness. Okay, so it's still on threes, so it's going to be fours. Okay, good. And then fours again. Did so the three, yeah. yeah, that many. Yeah, minus uh, minus two. Minus two, so four ups. How much damage each? Two damage each. So that'll kill three of them. Okay. Then we have uh, then we have this guy right here. No. Anyway, yeah, wait, wait. I'll go I'll second. Around, get it later. Um, so then we have uh, three attacks hitting on threes. That is my ultimate moment target, though. So it's dropped one. So it's still dropped one. So we have two. Strength 10, toughness 10, or toughness 12? Uh, toughness 12. So fives, uh, twin linked. Uh, so nothing. Centurion did nothing for me. Your attack, sir. That was a huge whiff of turns. <laughs> yeah, that turn was. <laughs> so where do you want to start? There? Uh, I might as well just start there. with the Wind Fortress. It's got six attacks. Hitting on. You do have Judge and Token. You move that Judge and Token over. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you do have, oh, you know what, speaking of judging tokens, look at the little guy, with the apothecary, so this guy's the, this, this one goes on them. Okay, so, on threes, because you do have one, and this is eight, or strength eight, toughness. Seven. So on threes, a two at AP zero. Two up. Oh, takes one damage. Just one damage. Alright, he's down to one. Let's go, little shred. <laughs> and then those guys are gonna slap back, so we're gonna pile in. There's gonna do that. Forward. So we'll do the six attacks. Mm, no, we'll do the three attacks on the character first. You don't have a judge token, so on threes. So dropping this one. Strength twelve versus toughness six. On the those yeah, six toughness. Six. Okay, yeah. so twos. Dropping one to one at AP one. Uh, saved it. AP one goes through damage five. Five damage. Okay, and then we're going to do the six attacks from the guys. So this is going to be on threes. Okay. Uh, it's going to be shrink six versus six, so fours. So that's going to be two. AP? At AP two. Oh, man. Damage? One. One, so one's going to be down to one. All right, so at the end of my turn, I did get three for engage, and I only killed one. One thing. So it's only two for no prisoners, because uh, nothing else died. Uh, you are holding uh, one, two, Three, so you're going to get 15. Four, actually, but you're still maxed out at 15. And we'll be back after uh, say the moving phase. All right, guys, uh, we are back after Slade's the moving phase. What card did you draw, sir? So I got. What card did you keep? We just need okay. to. Yeah, so 
I kept assassination overwhelming force. I did also draw a cleanse, but I, I needed the guns. I don't have any cheap bodies to do right. cleanse anymore, so I dropped cleanse. So I kept overwhelming force assassination. Okay. Movement. Uh, movement. I just moved this guy a little bit over so we can see these back group of guys for overwhelming force. We don't try to kill them. Uh, this guy stayed in combat because you can try to shoot that guy. These guys I spent a CP to fall back and shoot. So these guys fell back. They got Overwatch, and I lost another Terminator. Uh, these guys just moved up to shoot at this. This Sagittarius stayed behind to hold that objective, protect it from these Terminators. And then these guys moved up so they're within, they're within 12 of the uh, Bendik here. And then, okay. and then these three guys came in out of reserves in the backfield so they can potentially threaten this back of objective. Get ready. All right. We go... Do Go to shooting. I'm shooting. Mm. I don't know why. If Slay said, I want to take, I want to go after this Vindicator, I said, I don't know why he hasn't hit, he hasn't done anything in this whole game. Been oh. rolling twos like crazy. Assassination a hell of a drug. Uh, <laughs> it's a good move, dude. I'm just joking around. No, no, I got you. It's just because you're right. It hasn't done anything. He hasn't done zero anything. <laughs> uh, okay, we're going to do the Terminator squad into the um, aggressors. All right. So we'll just do the uh, Volcanite first. So hitting on, you know, you don't. Know, so just hitting on threes. Uh, this is going to be wounding on fives, but these are on sixes. Will be devastating. Nothing. So we're going to do the grenade launcher. Two shots. Threes dropping. Uh, again, fives. Oh, nothing. All right. The character's gone. So I've forgotten to shoot this whole game. Okay. <laughs> that was this guy here? Everything. Yeah, the actual, he actually has a gun. That's what the head thing's supposed to be. I think I'm uh, On fives, nothing. Okay, so that doesn't do anything. We're going to do it. We're going to go to the bikes. So the bikes are going to shoot everything into that unit of uh, assault intercessors with the character. All right. Because they can all see them. Yeah. Oh yeah, they can also. Okay, so we're gonna do shotguns first. There's a two shot hand range. That's gonna be six shots with the bolt shotguns. Hitting on because of the appraising glare on that objective, you are counting as plus one or one judging token. Okay. That's gonna be hitting on threes. And this is gonna be strength five versus toughness four, so on threes. That's going to be three AP zero. Three AP zero. Mm -hmm. Three ups. Takes one. Takes two, actually. Damage? One each. That just makes your charge harder if you decide to charge. So we're going to do the can the auto cannons into the squad as well. So it's going to be three shots each and so nine shots. Being on threes. And this is going to be strength seven versus four, so on threes again. Four? Okay, so four at 81. So four ups. Oh, no, jeez. Damage two. Two each? Yep. All right, so that kills all but the character. Okay, then we're going to do the big guy's gun. So it does get you uh, a overwhelming force. The rotary cannon fours sustained one. Uh, and this is strength six versus stuff. That's four, so on threes. It's going to be two at AP one. Two at AP one. Mm -hmm. So Agaton has a two up, so it's going to be three ups. Uh, takes one. Damage. Damage one. All right, he's down to four. Okay, we're going to do the Terminators, uh, everything. These guys, where, where are we at? Right the here. big Terminator squad. Everything into the Eradicators with the character. All right. The Rylogis. We'll do... We do have a lot of CP. So I think what we'll do is we'll pop the sustained. Make sure we get the kill. They do two dead dragons, so I'll be sustained two. And lethals. So, so he now becomes, I think, let me see this. I think Agathon becomes like a... Now he has damage, let's see. Okay. There's going to be ten shots of the plasma guns. Sixes, we both lethals and double sustained. Uh, we're hitting on twos. So we're getting this back and then getting another one back. 
So then this is going to be strength 9. This is toughness 6. So on 3s, but going to 2s because of the dead token. Dropping this 1. AP? AP 3. AP 3? Mm -hmm. So 6s. Is... Uh, none. Damage? Damage to each. All right, then. What's the, uh, how many did I get there? Take two at a, two at a time. So two, two. All right, that kills Emmett. Okay, so that gets the squad. I had to see if it got the biologist too, that's all. Okay, cool. That's done. We're going to do like this. Um, so I've already got an assassinate. I don't mm. need to take out the Vindicare necessarily. I would like to. Uh, we'll shoot. You know what? We'll just split fire. We'll we'll do this. We'll 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 say he's mad that he was getting shot a bunch. <laughs> so he'll put his gun into the Vindicare. Everybody else will put their gun into the inner space. These guys. All right. Sounds good. So three shots from him. Uh, you don't have a judge of token, so just hitting on these. Or no, he had twos because the plus one hit for a squad. So he will hit on twos, and then those guys will hit on twos. Oh, oh, shit. This is going to be strength five versus toughness. Well, three on my guy? I think it's yeah, uh, toughness. Toughness four, actually. Four, okay. And Transhuman now. All right, well, that's still. Still three. Still three. Two. So two at AP one. AP one. So he actually has a uh, a four up involve. Okay. Save one, fails one. Damage three. All right, he's down to one. Okay. And then these guys all into the it's gonna be one, four, ten, fourteen, nineteen. So on threes. And this their toughness is six. Yep. This is going into uh, interceptors, right? Yeah, the interceptors. Yeah. Okay, so this is gonna be on fives then. Yeah, it's AP two damage two. AP two damage two? Yep. Alright, so um I'm going to take it on the guy in cover first. Um, so it's going to be two of them. Uh, AP2, so it's going down AP1, so fours. Uh, both good. Uh, both good. Uh, both good. Wow, all right. You're right. Where was all that before, man? <laughs> yeah, where was there? Yeah, that's good one. Where's there only other? Okay, so all I got left is the. The two are this. Yeah, we'll do the Sagittar in the back against the Terminators. This guy here. Yeah, yeah. So missile launcher. Strength ten versus toughness five. So on twos. So one at AP three. Four up. Good. Okay, the uh, seven focused. Hits nine. So on threes. Hit AP one. Good. AP two. Doesn't matter. Four up. Yeah. Both four cannons. That one sustained. This is happening all right here, guys. Right in front of us. Hot action. Hot bolter fire. Oh, wait, that was the sustain. Let's hit the camera. I'm just kidding. All right, so that's going to be re rolling. So sixes would be on threes. That's okay. So three at AP1. Three AP1. Uh, three ups. Uh, Damage to each. All right, kills one. Cool. Uh, then the land fortress. The monster truck into the aggressors. He's going to put everything into the aggressors. All right. So, conversion beaver. Uh, I do get a sustained D3. So, just two shots. 10 versus so on threes. The one at AP2. One AP2, that's going to be five up. Good. Okay, he's got it. Do the auto cannon. No dead to them, right? So, I hit on fours. Uh, seven, so fours. Two and AP one. AP one, so it's gonna be fours. It takes one damage. Two. Two damage. Yeah. Everyone's one's down to one. Okay. On fours again. Yeah. 
This one, 26. So they're toughness. Oh, they had toughness 6, right? Yeah. I just thought they were toughness 7. So yeah. Yeah, okay, so that's going to be 2 at two, AP 1. 2 AP 1, so that's 3s. Uh, 4s, I'm sorry. Good. Okay. So one's down to one wound. Oh, actually, that kills one. All right, so the, that land forces is in combat with that uh, Centurion. is going to go and fight, or he's going to shoot everything to him. So actually, this this is going to negate big guns. Yeah, so it's going to it's going to so take it just regular four. for it. Yep. Just so everybody knows, big guns never tire because he's shooting in combat. His uh, judgment token is going to negate that. So fours. Okay, and then this is seven to seven, right? Yep. So fours. I know, plus one a wound, just so I get threes, but it doesn't matter. Three AP one. Three AP one. So threes. Come on, baby, stay alive. Nope. Nope. Got the infinite. Does return. he blow up? No, I'm just kidding. They don't I blow up. Did they blow up? No, no. no. <laughs> They're rigged with uh, explosives. Okay, so I will get charges or no charges. Did you want to charge so back they in will, here? Yeah, they're going to charge Vulcan. All right. Just I like it, dude. I would like to. That seems fun. <laughs> the aggressor, I don't think, is going to do much. Or, ooh, I don't know if that gets <laughs> in there. No, he's he's just in. Oh yeah, yeah he's yeah. You get to touch the character just with there. just with an honestly. Oh, I didn't mean to pick him up by his helmet, dude. No, that's fine. It should it should be pretty rock solid on there. And then this consolidate here. All right. Mm. Let me finish this turn. Uh, okay, so All right, going right in. I think that's it because I want to. Those guys stay on the objective. All right. So charge mortals on the character. Oop, don't they rolled a one, so it doesn't get it. D three or no? No, no, I, I rolled a one. Yeah, so it's nothing. You fail on a one. I got you. Uh, okay, then we'll just do the fighting. So, uh, three dropped one. String twelve or seven is five. So seven is four. Seven is four. Yeah, so twos. A one and AP one. Three up. Good. And then the other guy. No. And then shrink six versus four. So wounds. One at AP two. Uh, takes Damage it. Damage one. All right. He's down to uh, four. All right. My Vulcan fights back. He's going to have uh, six attacks. Hitting on twos. Uh, that's pretty good. Uh, and then we're going to have uh, strength is six to, what is it, five? Seven to six on them. So fours. Um, so five of them. I'm sorry, four of them. And AP two, two damage. Four of them? Yep. Looks Ooh. like it saved them all. Yeah, because AP two would take them to four ups. Yep. That was a very good roll. All right. All right. What'd you score, sir? So I got overwhelming force for three, and then assassination for. You got it for four, actually. You got overwhelming force for. You just killed two units on it. This one. Mm -hmm. That one. Oh, I did. Yeah, so it's five. Okay. So it'll be five Assass for overwhelming force, and then assassination. I got so that just uh, gives me five. All right, so I'm getting no points because I do not hold this one because you killed me off of it. I don't believe. Uh, Adrax is even close to being within three. We'll measure that out real quick. He is not. We'll be back after uh, my movement phase. All right, guys, we're back after my movement phase. Not a whole lot to do because uh, Slade here is windling me down. So he had a huge turn, as you saw in the score. And uh, so I brought bring it, I had bring it down in Storm Hostile Objective. Um, so I... Dropped Hassan back here so I could cover this objective because I need points. Um, also brought Agatone and this, I um, advanced this aggressor back so I can at least get some shots here. Uh, brought over Agatone, get some shots here. Uh, moved this guy. He failed the battle shock test, so I just moved him here. Might take on this here. Um, also, let me come around this side. I moved my eradicators to this side to cover this objective. Plus, I'm going to try to bring it down by killing this. Move these guys over here to uh, hopefully take care of something here. That's kind of what we got going on. So we'll go into shooting. And I'll start with my... Uh, let's start with my eradicators. 
which we're going to do a total of, uh, oh, Ulta Moment is going to be, uh, uh, hmm. Ulta Moment will make this squad right here. So that squad right there is going to have Ulta Moment. And, yeah, that's what we got going on. So total obliteration into this guy right here. Uh, hitting on fours because this is the multi multi uh, one, but I get to re-roll this because of that. So both hit. And then uh, strength, yeah, I'm outside of 12, so strength 9, toughness 10. So I need fives. Um, one, and then the other one on a just one. Yeah, minus four. You do get cover. Oh, you get cover? Okay. That's going to be a six. Sell it. D6. Four, five. He's down to four. And then here's the other two Malta, or the other Malta rifle, which is just one of them. Um, uh, does hit. Uh, now I need uh, five again. Uh, Reroll for proliferation. Nope. Oh, okay. Alrighty. So he's down to four. Let me just use uh, this guy here. Hitting on threes. Wounding on sixes. Nothing. Uh, that th is my ultimate target, so... No, that wasn't. That was that was not my ultimate target. All right, so then we're going to go here with the incurse, uh, Inceptors into that unit there. So it's going to be six shots. We're not going to supercharge because it's already two damage. How many How many damage are they? How many wounds are they? Who? Is yes? Yeah, two. They're three wounds each. Three wounds each. Man, you know how tempting it is to uh, supercharge this. Would it make it three damage? It'll make it three damage. Probably Let's do it. Charge. Let's yeah, do it. Probably supercharge it. I, I mean, I'm losing the game, so go I have to. Go yeah. Home. Go bigger go home. home. So here we go. Hitting on threes. They are my ultimate moment target, so it's a good thing. Uh, so still drop three of them. Uh, strength eight, toughness six. Six. Three. Uh, so doesn't miss this one. So we need two. At minus three this time, three damage. Let me see what the minus is before you roll it. If it's threes, then it'll be sixes. I mean, you can roll them and we'll see what, where it is. Because if you roll two sixes, it's going to... No, it's one five. Uh, so it's going to be uh, damage. It's minus three. Okay, yeah, so two fail. And then set out kill two guys. And actually, and we, between one more, because these are twin length, I didn't know that. So okay, I got so one more. Uh, and that does win. Or that. Okay, so you killed three. All right. Now we have the Vindicare <laughs> coming after your character. So the fourth time's your charm. All right, hits. Anything yeah. but a two, dude. Not oh, finally. three. <laughs> oh, that's going to be minus three. Yeah, minus three. Uh, if it's specifically against him, he doesn't take the. He doesn't. Is it save, four save? So, so yeah, it's three, it's three damage. Yep. Oh no, three damage. Yeah, it's uh, only three damage. I thought it was more than that. In that case, is it one wound? No, I needed that to be a D. I needed it to be a uh, a critical. Is that one wound? All right, so that's okay with that. Um, still took that objective. So we're gonna have uh, the fl we're gonna have the gauntlets go into this this unit here. So that's one D six plus one for. Seven, or I'm sorry, for six. Um, strength is four or five now because I'm we're within 12. And uh, what's the um, toughness on those guys? Six. Six. So we're going to uh, fives, just two twin links. So four at minus one. Four threes. Build three of them. How much damage? Uh, one damage each. Okay, so you're going to kill the last guy and put my main guy on four wounds. All right. All right, so uh, now we'll just put uh, Agatone into this guy, see if I can pick him off. So we're going to have uh, D3 plus three, or I'm sorry, D6 plus three. That's going to be nine shots. So there's uh, six plus three more. Uh, it's going to be Torrent, so it's auto hitting. Uh, I am within 12, so it's going to be strength five, toughness. Oh, six. So still fives. Uh, and we just have two. I'll get any re-rolls. 
AB? Because I'm not leading a uh, AB1. I'm not leading a unit. Threes? Spell blend. Just one. one damage. Is it down to three? Yep. Down to three. I'll change this for you. All right. And then uh, that is it for my shooting. Not great. But we will now go into charges. I will charge Agatone into this guy because he's my only charge that I'm going to make. Uh, and that Terminator inside. Terminator inside this guy. So Terminator first. Uh, he's in with the five. And then Agatone. Uh, he's in with a seven behind the scenes because I usually don't show this. All right, so he's in, and now I will. Uh, now we will just go right into fight phase because you do have two to interrupt. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that this one first okay. because I don't know if that thing can do damage to me. Might, Can't. maybe could. Okay. Um, so we're gonna go here. Agatone has five attacks and uh, hitting on twos. They all hit. And then it's going to be uh, strength is 10. 7 to 6. So threes. So we have three at minus two, three damage. Okay. So if, one, if I fail one of these, he dies. Okay, so four ups. Oh. Failed one, he dies. Does he come no back? No reroll? No reroll, but he does come back. How would you want to reroll? Uh, Up to you. Mm. Or you want no. to take the chance he comes back? Yeah, I'll just. The thing is, he could fail. To come back. What's that? What's yeah, he, I, I do he... roll the one here. I, you know what? I think I will just reroll. All right. I'll give it a good old reroll. No, nope, right. got a one. Okay. Does he come back? Yep. He does. Okay. It comes back on a two up. Two up, yeah. Dude, that would have been your comeback roll. I know, <laughs> I know, yeah. That's why I'm almost glad I sent that CP. <laughs> You know the amount of times I've rolled a one on that? I, I It's insane the amount of times I've rolled a one on that. Right, so we'll, we'll move that in a minute because he does come back and he has to. I'm sure he can't be in engagement range. Yeah, he can't be in engagement range. Just outside of engagement range. As and he comes as possible, back at the end of the that. turn, right? At the end of the phase. Yeah. So, all right. So, uh, Power Fist, we got here. We have um, three attacks hitting on, hitting on twos. Hitting on threes, I'm sorry. Oh, uh, that'd be zero. All right. <laughs> you want to fight back with that guy? Yeah, three attacks. On All threes. Hit. And then strength. Uh, it's only strength six versus toughness five. five. So three is twos, which is kind of comical. All, All right, right, so it's going to be three at AP zero. Well, two up. It would have been bad if I just rolled three ones. Yeah, and he died <laughs> to a Sagittar. He's down to two. All right, so not an exciting. Oh, you get to fight back here. Uh, well, no, because oh, he's you, dead. You he's killed dead. him, yeah. Mind, so mind. just just pull him outside of engaging range and, and give me that dice because he's back to full one. All right, so at the end of my turn, I did end up getting storm hostile objective over there, um, and I did not get bring it down because this thing did live. So I will. Uh, I'm going to actually get rid of bring it down. So that's going to go up to. I'm going to go up to two ZP. You were holding. One, two, three objectives. Mm -hmm. So you're going to get 15 again. And we'll be back after Slade's movement phase. All right, guys, we are back after Slade's movement phase. Slade, what'd you draw? So I got no prisoners, secure no man's land, and attempting target. But I'm going to discard attempting target. <laughs> yeah, pretty sure. I don't want that these one. are easy. <laughs> uh, okay, so we're going to yeah, start. Yeah, you, you already got it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You got secure no man's land. Yeah, yeah. All right, and then we are going to add a judgment token to. Oh, we're just going to do that. We're just going to flip this guy to a two. Okay. Just for the call that's right here. All right. So what did you do movement wise? So movement wise, we move these guys over so they can start killing some stuff off this objective. Um, we move these guys back down so they can take this objective back. We fell back and chart, or we. Fell back with this, and we spent the CP to have him fall back, shoot, and charge. Okay. We didn't move this guy at all. We moved that guy up a little bit so he can kill this last aggressor. And we moved these guys up to take the backfield objective. Okay. And then we kept that guy standstill as well, so because he's just going to try and kill that last that character. All right. So hopefully at the end of this turn, the only thing that's left alive is the, 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 vindicare. the vindicare assassin. <laughs> yeah. And he can spend his turn five trying to kill that character <laughs> one last time. <laughs> 
Uh, okay, so we'll do. I guess we'll do the Sagittar first into the uh, Terminator. All right. So it's two shots from a Sagittar missile launcher. Whiffs on both, or both shots. So the L7 missile launcher hits on a three. Uh, strength nine, versus toughness five. So on threes, got it. Four up. Or what's a what's a it's AP two? Yep. Four up. Damage D six. Five blow damage. Up? Does he blow up? No, he doesn't. <laughs> Does he blow up? Yeah, he's dead. So that's the first Snow Prisoners one. Uh, we'll do that land fortress, everything into that aggressor that I can see. Okay. So we'll do the uh, be this guy into this aggressor. conversion beamer. I did get one four, and you're, for the first time in this game almost, I think, in conversion range, you're outside of 12, but within 24. Gotcha. So I'm going to get D3 sustained. I got one sustained, so that's two shots. Strength 10. So that's going to be one at AP2. One AP2. Um, one good cover on this, right? Ignores cover on the oh, land. Oh, ignore cover. Five up. Good. Saved it. Okay, then we're going to do the auto cannon shots. Okay, so that's just going to be on threes. Oh, wait, do you have a judgment? No judgment. You don't, so dropping the threes as well. Okay, so just going to be three hits. This is strength seven. So on threes. So three at AP1. Three AP1, so there's going to be four ups. Uh, damage three. two. Damage two. He's down to one. Okay, we'll do the bolt. Just trying to survive. Bolt cannons. Sustain six. So getting this two back. Dropping these two. So this is going to be on sixes. So fours. Twin linked. AP. One. So three at AP one. Ignoring cover. Threes is again. Or fours again. I'm sorry. Uh, that'll get him. He's dead. We're going to do... The bikes into the Vulcan. Bikes in the Vulcan. Okay. So it's going to be. Uh, what's their AP? It's going to be zero, one, and one. Zero, one, and one. Um, I kind of want him to live, so I'm going to do armor of contempt. Okay. So we'll do the bolt shotguns first, hitting on threes because you count as being plus one objective because you're on the uh, prison glare target. Yep. So it's going to be four. Strength five versus toughness five, right? Yep. Not a toughness four. Toughness four. And Vulcan? Yeah. Looks like he's in Gravis Arm. Oh, that's four right there. Mm. No, wait, I mean, whoever's on that object. Who's the guy closest to that? Yeah, Vulcan. Oh, isn't that, isn't that the Vulcan's model? This is, no, this is, uh, this is a custom Oh, it's model. a custom model for yeah. Vulcan. And, then and you're using the Vulcan model. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, so this is, Ava no, no, this is Agaton. Is that good time? That's Vulcan. Gotcha. Okay, because I was looking at this and I was like, isn't that? Yeah. yeah. Okay, I got gotcha. you. <laughs> All right, so that's going to be two at AP0. Two AP0? Mm -hmm. uh, two ups. Good. Two at AP0. Uh, we're going to do nine shots from the uh, auto cannons. Hitting on threes. Well, I mentioned that was hitting on fours. I would have cried. <laughs> it's all threes. <laughs> Uh, okay. Yeah, because he's standing on an objective, so. Yeah. So with that token now. With that token right there. Okay, so it's going to be strength seven versus whatever, so threes. Four. Four at AP1. AP1, so three ups. What's the damage? Two each. So don't fail it. Uh, fail Two. it. Alright, so Vulcan dies. Vulcan has spawned is dead. There used to be, last, last edition, I would be able to roll up and stand up but i don't have that this edition all right so the uh character is going to shoot that a character right in front of him all right so he's four versus five so that's nothing tough as four. Oh, it's four. four. Well, four then that one four so one at ap zero all right two up good good okay then we're going to do the terminator squad we, how do we split the fire here? Um, I think we're going to do... Because the OC is just one for each, both these squads, right? Right, yeah. Um, I think we'll do what we did last time again. We're just going to put all the plasma guns. But this time we'll put all the plasma guns into these guys, the uh, Inceptors. And then we'll put all the grenade launchers and his gun into the Eradicators. All right, just tell me what you do first. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is everything into the Eradicators. All right. So the character's gun, which is four shots. 
has strength five or start toughness six. So five is going to four because the gen token. So three at AP zero. AP zero, so four up. Or three up, I'm sorry. Damage. One each. All right, so that one's going down to one. All right, so it's going to be the grenade launchers. Still going into the eradicators? Yeah. So 10d6 grenade launchers. That's so going to be two, four, eight, nine, 19, 25. Yeah, I always count by fours for some reason. <laughs> it's easier for me. Anyway. What are you hitting on? Uh, hitting on twos because of the gem token. Having ones, uh, sixes will be lethals. So this was a six. That's it. Yep. Okay. And then this is going to be strength four. For stuff in a six, so that's going to be fives. Going to fours because of the judging button. Yep. So, dropping. Yeah, on all this. All this. AP? Yeah, AP zero. AP zero, so uh, three ups. Uh, damage? One each. It right, kills the one and kills both of them. Okay. So the eradicators are gone. And then the plasmas into the scepters. All right. Uh, the lethals. Having the one. Okay, and it's going to be strength nine versus the toughness six, so it's going to be on three. AP? AP three. AP three, so it's going to be uh, sixes. Two, two damage each. Yep. So uh, one guy dead, two guys three there. All right, kills him. Okay. So I wiped out everything over there. Use your dudes. Thank you. Did you way too excited to hand these over to me? <laughs> <laughs> I just was like, let's clear it out. I like, I like, I like a clear board. <laughs> uh, okay, and that is. Oh, then we're gonna do the charges. Is the only thing left. All right. Is charging. Literally, Agaton is the only model I have left on nope. the table. Besides the vinegar. <laughs> That's the vinegar. All right, so we're gonna do the charge there. He's in. He's in. Just re we'll yeah, just go to the. I get an eleven, by the way. <laughs> no, 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 charge mortals. Got a four. D three. Two. Two. So he's gonna be down to three. Okay, so three attacks hitting on threes, dropping the two. String twelve versus his toughness. Four. So on two. So one at AP. Uh, two. AP two. So he's got a four up anyway. Yeah. Um, what uh, what's the damage? It'll be D six plus one. Oh, okay. So it could kill him unless I roll this. Here we go. Up oh, out of the. Oh, uh, so I'm a, I'm only. What is it? Is it two for sure? It's AP two. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna re-roll that. Spend my CP, re-roll it. Need a four? All right, got it. He's alive. All right, now he gets to swing back. So six attacks. Or five attacks, I'm sorry. Hitting on twos. Wounding on threes, because of strength ten. Uh, so three of them at minus two, three damage. Four been and he's dead. All right, so I killed him twice. Killed you did kill him twice back to back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Agatone is the only one I have left on the score. So uh, just we'll just go right into my next turn because well we'll do the score real quick. You did score secure Mons Man Land. You did score maxed out prisoners. Yep. Um, so we'll be back after the score. All right, guys, here's what we got. So you saw the score. It's un unreachable. I only have two miles left on the table. So just for fun, just for giggles, <laughs> we're going to see if this assassin can kill this guy that he's been shooting at legitimately all game long, <laughs> except for the first round. So on twos. This is for, oh, I did get assassination, so this will make me go up five points. Um, I guess if I really wanted to, I can move him over to six and try to take this objective from you. I don't think I kill everybody there, but we'll try it just for extra points. Uh, so twos for the uh, assassin hits 
Uh, I'm gonna do the Stormbreaker thing. So you Shield breaker. Saves. Yeah, okay. You don't get a save. All right, there we go. There you go. So minus three. He's dead. Finally kills. All right, assassination. That's great. Now we'll do uh, his melee attack. Or I'm sorry, we'll do his uh, his flamer attack, which is going to be D6 plus three. Man, he's been rolling. He's actually rolled really odd, this guy. So that's nine again. I mean, him alone has probably killed more things but than the alarm. <laughs> he, really, <laughs> he really has, dude. Um, all right, so then we have, uh, it's going to be strength five because of the firestorm. And it's going to be a uh, uh, minus one. So strength five, so I need. I think I need, uh, that'll be my ultimate moment target since I don't have anything else. It doesn't matter because these are... I needed fives, because I'm sure you're you're higher than six. My toughness is six. All right, yeah. So you're higher. So it's minus one. Three at minus one. So three five ups. Hold them all. One damage. damage. So one damage each. You'll kill the guy in the back. All right. So we'll charge. Unless I roll a two on the dice, he's in. I'll roll it just to make sure. Just want to do it right. I did roll two on the dice, but it was <laughs> double twos. Double twos. All right. So five attacks. Hitting on twos. Okay. This is Agatone going in here. Guys, again, game's over. It's already won. Uh, we're just doing this for fun. Uh, hits on twos. Hits everything. Uh, wounding on two. I'm sorry, wounding on threes. I'm not showing any strength five. No, you're tough to six, right? Tough to six, yeah. So threes. Hits them all. So we have five at minus two, three damage each. Minus two takes them to six ups. Get one six. Do you say two damage each? Three damage each. Oh, that kills that. That kills the squad. Look at Agatone, man. I gotta get this. What the heck were you doing back here the whole time? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. So, so at the end of the turn, at the end of, at the, the game, essentially, but at the end of my turn, I'm gonna get five for holding one. Um, I'm gonna get five for uh, uh, assassination from the Vindicare. and uh, we'll be back. Let me show the score real quick. We'll be right back. Yeah. All right, guys, you saw the score. Uh, ended up being 77 to 48. Last two turns you had slayed were 50 point turns, like 25. Yeah, yeah. And then 25 again. Yeah. Uh, good secondary is a good time to come up. But you actually started whittling things down with your gun. I couldn't kill these things. My eradicators, even with total obliteration, um, which is good. I like it. It just didn't do enough. Yeah, At least yeah. on the big stuff that was toughness 12. Yeah. Now, I wasn't within close to make it top this 11. Still would have been winning on fives. It doesn't matter. Um, it was able to pick these things up, but nothing else. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Uh, it was a good game, man. So, Voltan, still pretty decent. Yeah. I mean, I know a lot of people like to complain about stuff. Still pretty decent. Um, I know, guys, that I'm sure I made some mistakes in this. I might have forgot something. I'm sure I did because um, I look back at some stuff, and I know I forgot some lethals. On my biologist, but I don't know if I, I don't know if I rolled any sixes, so it doesn't matter. I'm sure I could have played a little bit strats differently, but I did. So that's the way it is. I'm having fun with it. I mean, it's your first time. First time the armor, back, right? exactly yeah. with with salamanders and playing firestorm growlings or firestorm uh, assault. But dude, I appreciate you coming over. Yeah. Thoughts on Votan? What do you like? What do you don't like? I, I like, like it this with big them. monster truck, dude. Yeah, it's the first time playing to the the double land fort, which is what it, most a lot of people play. You know, it's very strong. Yeah. It's just tough to kill. It's, Everybody can usually, if you have one, everybody focuses down the one. It's usually, it usually dies fairly right. early. But when you have two, it's like you kind of just threat both of them. I really also just, I love having the uh, real wounds on the land fortresses for the mm -hmm. Vulcanites because you could just, you just get a lot of devastatings with you when you have the dudes coming out of it that turn. So just like land forts are great. Dude, I, I really noticed good. you don't run the bike heavy list. No. Is there a reason? Well, they just, they die. They die. They just, Anytime I run bikes, because I love bikes, <laughs> I love bikes, but they just die. They just die. Yeah, they just die the yeah like they character. just, and they're hard to hide, because especially when you run big six man, because I love bikes. Right. Like in my crusade list, I just run a ton of bikes. So but how, it's like it just doesn't really do the damage that you need it to. How how many points are there? Uh, I uh, three is ninety. So three, oh, three is that that yeah. squad was ninety points. Yeah, it was ninety points. Oh, dude, that's that's like. That's why you always take at least one. Yeah, dude, because I you always I mean, take even, at least even, one. Because it's just the, the mission scoring is where you want it. Yeah, but, sure. like, if you're taking, like, if I was going to take, you know, what, 18, like, it just wanted, you know, even if you gave it sustained, like, again, certain profiles, it does it really well because it is right. damaged. They do have nine. 
you know, three shots each for damage two right. with the uh, Shrink 7 auto guns, which, which can do really well. Right. For sure, especially against Space Marines where damage two is just everything. Right. But uh, as in certain things, it just doesn't doesn't really do the damage you need it to for committing that many points. Right. Now, great, they're great skirmishers. That's why I love them because yeah. they're toughness six. So like any of uh, in, in other people's skirmishing pieces, just don't damage them. Right. Like they're just not going to kill them. They end for ninety points coming up off the board and then coming and back, coming yeah. back down in someone else. It's a Kaladius assassin with you know instead of having like four wounds, it has yeah. twelve. Yeah, it actually is real nice because yeah. then you, it helps you play. It helps Voltan play the mission. Very well. Yeah, I didn't yeah. realize there were only 90 points for three. Yeah. I thought that was, that's, that it was much good. higher. Yeah. I thought oh, it was no. like yeah. 150 or something like No, like no, no. That. It's 160 for the six man bikes. Yeah, dude. That's like three of them just to bring them up, like I said, come up, get yeah. behind enemy lines, get, uh, you know, in, investigate signals even. I mean, yeah. It makes that card at least worth something. Then uh, even though it's the worst card in the whole deck. But, <laughs> <laughs> but hey, man, I appreciate you coming on. Slate. Thank yeah. you very much. Uh, like I said, like, as always, guys, God bless and peace out.